All right, what's good? Good morning, everybody. Happy, happy Saturday. Happy, happy, happy weekend. What's good, everybody? Good morning. <clears throat> what up, what up, what up, guys? Hold on, give me a second. Um, good morning, KB. What's good? 25, what up, man? How's everyone doing? Dude, a lot of stock on this shoe, dude. A lot of stock. Hit that like button. What up, Chris Montgomery? It's Mike. What's good? Trey Ways says, happy weekend. Paulo, what's good? Happy 420, my boy. Oh, my gosh. 420. Days. Casanova, Deleon, Dominic, James, what up? <clears throat> Ugh, dude, I feel so bloated this morning, bro. James, Grand Rising Road to Greatness was good. Going to pick up my Palominos in a few. Yeah, I'm going to be picking up a pair later this uh, later this morning, this late evening or late morning. Um, Because my mall doesn't open until like 11. Black Jesus, what up? Cast knows this. Good morning, Rafi. Good morning, collection family. What to do? Cast, thank you so much for sending those uh stocks, man. I appreciate that. I saw that. I saw that tag. Thank you. Top of the morning for you. What up? Uh, evil, what up? Father Rafi, we need some prayers in the chat. Uh, Father Rafi, we need facts, bro. I think a lot of you guys will hit this morning. Yantic, what's good? Michael in the building. Jay Million, Natasha, Andrew. Uh, Dank, what up, Dank? It's just my boy Dank in the building. Trey Way says, neat coffee. There you go. Scene Lover says, run it up. Uh, 25 says, morning, Rafi. Happy weekend, brother. You as well, 25. Appreciate you, man. Uh, Trey Way says, need a uh, blessing today, man. A lot of you guys should hit. Uh, a good amount of stock number shots, my boy Casanova for sending that over. Um, but if you guys don't mind, smack that like button. Do appreciate you guys tapping in as always. Um, where's the breakfast burrito at, Raf? Oh man, no, no, no burritos this morning, bro. I'm like, I don't know for some reason, I'm just stupid bloated, like, like stupid, stupid bloated. Like I felt like there's just so much water weight. Um, stinking burrow. What up, man? Good morning to you, my friend. Appreciate you tapping in. Delion's is going to be an easy one. You think so? I mean, I feel like, I feel like most of you guys should hit, uh, it looks like a, what? 193 K, uh, stock loaded. I guess this is the stock number is what it's looking like. So, I mean, I feel like most of you, most of everybody is going to go for this shoe, um, today. I mean, dude, there's a lot of stock. So I feel like there should be a good amount of W's just like 12 and a half, 2,600, but which is not a lot, a lot at all. Um, but I mean, 193 K you pregnant Raf? dude. I know I'm not pregnant. I really hope so. Is this shoe doubly up worthy, uh, at all? Um, it's up to you. If you really like the sneaker, what up Deleon? Uh, Justin got my double up in, um, uh, Paula's there we go. Uh, Maganda Umaga, Raf, what up, dude? Cle uh, is it Cleeds? Thunder 4s are way better. Why would you compare these to Thunder 4s? That wouldn't be a good comparison. My Supreme Dunks from Thursday release are out for delivery today. Let's effing go. There you go, Michael. Mine finally got shipped. Mine got shipped out yesterday, so my Supremes got shipped out. I got my unions in yesterday. I got I got to take a look at those, and I'll, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll pull them up on the screen here shortly. Um... I saw pizza uh, drive this uh, morning, you think? Not right. What he said. I saw pizza drive this morning, you think? Not, wait. Wait, what? Uh, easy cop. I've been uh, having a burrito and coffee morning since 6 a.m. Eastern time. My Oh, my gosh. Jesus Christ. You, well, that's your problem, bro. You had a burrito and you had a coffee. I, dude, that's like, that's like a terrible mix together to begin with. Coffee and a burrito. Yellow uh, label kills it for me. Um, I mean, Jimmy, like the label on the, the, it's not like really, it's gold, but like, it's only on the, like the, the Nike tab on the tongue. I mean, it's not bad. Uh, shout out to my boy, Dank, got me sleep for the two. He says, want a four Udo last night for 25 bucks. You want a, a four Udo, like a size four Udo for 25 bucks. What was it? Did you, did you, did you win it? Did you win it off like a raffle? That's crazy. Yo, dang, bro, you might as well go buy yourself a lotto ticket. This man said he wants some Udo dunks. One of four Udo last night for 25 bucks. For 25 bucks. I'm assuming that's like a uh, a, a, a raffle, right? Oh, your fourth. You won your fourth Udo last night for 25 bucks. How? Chris, what's good? Where's the first drop of these Palominos? Anything uh, before 10? 
Um, I don't know if undefeated dropped. Like we could double check on undefeated. Let's check undefeated real quick. Do they drop at five? Unless they don't, they'll probably drop them at um 10 Eastern time. Yeah, it looks like everything is dropping at 10, bro. Everything is dropping at 10 Eastern time. Looks like everything should be dropping at 10. You want it on an IG raffle slot? There you go. That's that's some luck right there for 25 bucks is is uh, that's crazy, bro. Yudos look clean in person. Came in yesterday. There you go. Uh, Rafi, I got my Yudos yesterday from Undefeated. Congrats, bro. That's a huge W. What up, Chris? Good morning, man. Uh, that's a huge W. Uh, Bob, not the builder. What's good, bro? Uh, good morning to you, my friend. Appreciate you guys. Ta Briss, what's up, man? Thanks so much for tapping in and drop earlier. Okay. Dude said that about four hits about 100 times. Holy ish. <laughs> that's my boy, Dank, man. Uh, Breezy Small says hit that like button. Got the day. Get Let's get the day going. Yes, sir, man. I feel so refreshed this morning. Because like every time I feel bloated in the morning, dude, I have to, like, I, for some reason, I always hop in the shower just to see that normally helps me just to get like body like dude i don't know why i feel extra extra bloated this morning um undefeated probably at nine eastern time you think so undefeated i've never seen undefeated drop anything at six sometimes six a.m huh we'll see uh, the palominos are sitting on sneakers eu uh will these sit i don't know i don't think these will sit here in the u.s i don't think this shoe will sit maybe certain sizes may like It'll make it'll take a while to like sell like dude size 10 10 and a half dude over 20,000 in stock is crazy dude like over 20,000 in stock is actually pretty insane like if you're a size 10 10 and a half I think you have no problem of hitting this morning I think everybody that really wants this shoe should be able to hit this morning respectfully because they dude over 20,000 in stock is crazy um uh i need these uh palominos badly i've uh missed all raffles so far brian you're gonna hit today bro i promise you will hit today man you will hit today i believe in you my friend you will hit today i think everyone shouldn't have any problem of hitting this morning i think besides if you're like a 12 and a half maybe a 14 dude 14 3744 is not a lot at all uh, bro, I don't want Palominos. I got in store pickup on finish line. Now I don't want them. I ain't getting uh, points back, huh? No, bro. If you don't pick up your pair, you will not get points, bro. Because you end up, you basically just wasted points for nothing. So I feel like you might as well go pick it up, get your points, and sell the shoe for retail. I already hit. There you go. Uh, I need to double up on the Palominos. Um, these are, uh... Oprah, these are Oprah stock numbers, <laughs> dude. Like 193k is insane. Um, uh, but I mean, there was no sneaker list and there was no sneaker exclusive access on this shoe. So, I mean, I'm assuming that's the reason why the stock is super, super high, you know. Thanks, Ravi, manifesting this win today. Uh, in my size 10, yeah, they're gonna be dropping. If you guys want these for retail, listen. Your best bet is buying these shoes on Finish Line and JD Sports and using your twenty dollar coupons. All right, if you have coupons from like Finish Line and uh, Finish Line and JD Sports, your chances are are very high this morning of hitting. I feel like most people are probably going to use Finish Line and JD Sports, so you could get this under retail like easily, bro, easily. I rather get this shoe for under retail. I mean, um, if I have an opportunity to do so, I, I would take the chance for sure. I thought the full locker raffle would be done by now. Uh, so if you're talking about like the uh, the what's it called the uh, the online raffle for full locker, like the ship to me option from full locker and champs, the notifications will go out at 6 a.m. That's 9 a.m. Eastern time. So if anybody I see, listen, I forget about these flex app because I never try. But if you did try on the ship to me option on Champ Sports and Foot Locker, notifications will go out at 6 a.m. today. All right. That is 9 a.m. Eastern time. All right. These are dropping damn near everywhere. Yeah. I mean, like I said, guys, if you want these, this is only for the toe. I've explained this numerous times, right? I know a lot of people are surprised. Some people are surprised how the, uh, the, the resale value for the shoe is, is kind of low, but I think it's because like there's just, there was just so much stuff dropping in the month of August. I feel I feel like people kind of forgot about this sneaker in a way. Um, so like you know 
people were just like, you know, whatever. Jordan one, another Jordan one dropping. Whoop de doo. But still, like, it's beautiful to see this Jordan. Like, for this colorway and the way it is, like, it doesn't. It well, it does surprise me in a way. But at the same time, like, is it? It's a Jordan one, so it doesn't surprise me. But it's nice to see that a nice colorway like this is going for like almost damn retail. You feel me? Like, think about that, guys. Like, like shoe like this if this was to drop in like 2020 you know 20 maybe 2021 um like during the like what's it called um what was that shoe that dropped in 2020 guys can anyone remind me it was like late 2020 um it had like green brown pink on it god every time i every time i bring up this shoe i always forget um, and that shoe went for like 300 bucks. It was the same year when the midnight Navy blue Jordan one highs dropped, um, with the silver swoosh, uh, biohacks. Thank you so much. Thinking burrow. See, like if this was like to drop during the biohack time, this shoe would easily been like 450, 400 because biohacks were going for off the rip for like three, 350. You know what I'm saying? So like if this was to drop during the biohack, this shoe would absolutely would have been like a 300 plus dollar shoe, you know? So it's just nice that we could see Jordan ones, you know, for this, this colorway, the way it is, you know, go for how much it is today. Right. So like, for instance, all I'm saying is that like, if the bio hacks was to drop in 2023, bio hacks would have easily been uh, way under retail, way under retail. Okay. Bio hacks were really, really popular when they dropped. Okay. I, why? Because I remember that drop. Okay. I sold pairs for like 300 bucks and the shoes definitely tanked down. Well, down to a little bit over 200 bucks, depending on the size, but these shoes are still holding its price at 250. Okay. 240, 254, 295 for a size 13. So like, all I'm saying is that like, if this shoe would have dropped uh, during that bio act time, we would have been paying 300, 350 plus for this shoe. But that's why I'm saying it's nice that, you know, the Jordan one wave, I don't know what happened to it. It's nice that we could at least afford shoes that, you know, that we want. So, um, at least we're not going to be like, Oh, taking it now, now to pay three fifty to 400 bucks for the sneaker. Hey, the shoe goes for damn retail. So I ain't complaining at all. Uh, easy pass. I already got the, uh, mochas and Travis ones. Don't think I would wear these if I cop also not really feeling the Brown swoosh. Okay. I mean, shoe's not bad at all. If you need a brown, black, white shoe, is a perfect, you know, perfect time to have. If you don't have the mochas, listen, if you don't have the mochas, if you don't have the Travis's, this is a perfect alternative. Just saying. What's my most underrated Jordan 1 high in my sneaker collection? My most underrated Jordan 1 high, I would say... I would say most underrated. I would say taxis, man, because taxis are like a really great colorway. Taxis are a really great colorway. I feel like that's like a great alternative for the uh, shadow backboards in a way. Um, but it's still a great shoe, great quality on the sneaker. I, I would say that's like probably my best and underrated uh, Jordan 1 in my sneaker collection. Uh, mochas have the little uh, swoosh on them and looks like a woman's uh, woman's release. Mochas have the little swoosh on them and looks like a woman release. Okay. Uh, the fact that you're here on Labor Day weekend makes you a real one. I mean, bro, you know, I'm here on uh, on any release that comes out. You know what I'm saying? Like when it comes to sneaker releases, your boy is here. So your boy will, is here. So I appreciate you tapping in. These will sell later on. It's a mature shoe like I'm a Manier 4s. When us sneakerheads get older, these are the kind of shoes we will want. I mean, yeah. I mean, this shoe, I mean, ev eventually, like, over time, like, this shoe is definitely going up, right? But, like, you know, we're, uh, throughout, you know, the year of this, the rest of the year, you're going to see a bunch of restocks. Nike is going to hold out pairs. Like, of course, like, the next Jordan Reserve wouldn't be surprised if these pop up. At this point, the way like Jordan Jordan brand and Nike is doing, like the amount of pairs that they hold back, I bet you this is not even the full stock. I bet you this is not even the full stock. I bet you like they have more stock they hold back for like, you know, a later date of a Jordan Reserve and they'll drop the rest of the pairs then. So 
when I said uh, Lil Swoosh talking about everything uh, about Jordan 1's Lost and Founds, they adjust the shape and size of the swoosh on the side. Okay. I mean, I, I, me personally, I haven't noticed. Are you going for them? Um, I'm already, I'm already picking up a pair. Age, uh, a tribe. I'm already picking up a pair later. No personal for you, Raph. Um, not exactly. I wanted to see these in hand, see how I feel about it. Like originally I was like, not, I was originally going to pass, but then you know what? I was like, F it. Let me just go, go for a pair. Um, so I'm going to have a vlog for you guys later this afternoon. Um, and give you guys my thoughts and opinions, how they look like in person. Uh, I got a, and I end up getting a W at finish line. So I'm going to be blessing someone for retail for the sneaker anyway. So it doesn't really matter. Uh, you think GS pairs will hit, uh, or sit? I don't think, I mean, maybe I, I don't know, bro. I, I really don't know. GS pairs. I mean, I think, I think if you're going to go for GS pairs, I think it should be an easy W. I think, I think, I don't know, bro. I really don't know what makes, uh, why make so many of these and not enough sbs like this is so trash um i mean casey I, I don't know i mean i wish i could answer that question for you why why is sbs more limited uh just because like they they cater to a lot of the skate shops i mean i don't i i, I, I wish i could tell you but i don't know if it's more you know material that they have to add on into an sb I, I don't know but they always keep the sb somewhat limited um i, I don't know because it's more of a quick strike like SPs are known for just quick strikes. They're not your just ordinary, you know, general release, you know, that you could just go in to finish line and JD Sports, like, I don't know. Uh they have to protect their SB brand if they uh did to uh if they did uh that to SB what they did to Jordan, it would tank and sit. Yeah. All right. Like the thing is they gotta keep I guess they gotta keep the SBs like more like exclusive in a way. I don't know. I don't make those decisions. I wish I can, but I mean, I, I don't know. Uh, damn, almost 200k is wild. Yeah, what up, Rahus? Good morning. My um, my unions haven't shipped yet, um, as well. But that's uh, number for union if you know. Yeah, eventually you're gonna get your unions. I just got my unions in today or yesterday. Uh, what are you looking into today, bro? For shoes? Uh, just the Palominos are dropping today. Palominos are the only thing that's dropping this morning. They're going to be dropping at 10 a.m. Eastern time. Do you think the high stock numbers uh, has to do with the rise of the Jordan 1 lows or no correlation? Do you think the high stock number has to do with the rise of the Jordan 1 lows or no correlation? I don't think so, bro. Um, did your Supreme SB ship out? Yeah, my Supreme SB shipped out yesterday. I got an email yesterday from Supreme and my Supreme SBs are on the way, which I'm actually really excited about it. What up, Michael? Good morning to you, my friend. SPs are more limited to uh, keep it relevant uh, by keeping it exclusive. Yeah, I feel like even like, like, don't get me wrong, like this year, Nike has made a huge, like, if you want to talk about general release about an SB, it's got to be the gum pack bottom. Like my skate shop restocks the white gum bottoms and the black gum, gum bottoms almost every other month. And I feel like that's the most like restock shoe when it comes to the SB side. Like, you know, we've seen so many, you know, different kinds of restocks on Jordan and Nike, like Panda Dunks and stuff like that. You know, Jordan, you know, Jordan, random Jordan restocks on Nike. That's kind of equivalent to the skate shops right now. It's literally the black and white gum bottoms and the white and black gum bottoms are always restocking at skate shops every other month. And you just got to follow your skate shops and uh, on Instagram because they like post it randomly. Um morning brother el migos what's good good morning i'm waiting on my supreme sbs and travis Scott air force ones there you go rah bro i need the white gum bottoms and they're nice sps is, is uh is special the uh only nike line that doesn't really ever retro yeah exactly and that's why like that's why if you like grab like sbs now and grab them while they're low um, eventually those prices are gonna go up man the general public doesn't wear dunks sbs for the most part yeah i would say so like just because like some of the like SBs that do drop are kind of exclusive, like even like some of the like uh, like the events that I go to, like some of the events that I went to the last the last year, like I feel like most people wear like Jordans at events. Um, you don't for some reason you don't really see SB dunks. Like I've been to many events and you'll see like some SB dunks here and there, but I feel like most like public would like people in the public that just wear jordans but i mean i don't know i guess it just depends where you live 
Uh, bro, in the in Europe, they already dropped and they don't. Uh, they didn't sell out. Yeah, I know. Someone in the EU came in here and said they were sitting. I never see SBs in the wild. You don't. Just depend on the like certain SBs. Like, like SBs now. Like, you rarely see anyone rock like chunky donkeys. Um, I haven't really seen anyone be rocking Travis SBs anymore. Um, what else? Like paras. Like I have a pair of paras, and it's rare to see anyone wear that SB out in the public. Um, Orange Lobsters was a pretty uh, big release last year. Like I, I, when I went to a couple sneaker cons, I've seen a lot of people rocking Orange Lobsters. Uh, I saw the uh, Polaroids a bit. Okay, Polaroids. The casual person is not wearing a um, over padded dunk. Yeah, like SBs are not like they're not uh, they're not the most comfortable shoe. Like people always like be like, oh SBs are more comfortable than regular dunks, but I just feel like like. I don't know. Like SBs are just not as comfortable as people what people think. It's kind of similar to like Jordan Fours. Like people are like, "Oh, Jordan Fours are the best," but like they're just like not comfortable. How do you uh, see the stock? Uh, I mean, this is just gets tagged uh, from Twitter. People just tag me on Twitter with stock numbers, and I just kind of show it on the screen if anybody wants to see big sizes, please. Yeah, of course, man. There's the bigger sizes for you, man. Uh, black gum bottoms are the only SBs I have. Okay, that's totally fine. You know, I only have like the amount of like SBs that's dropped in the past years. Like the only the only SBs that I have in my sneaker collection, I only got like five, six pairs. Like you feel me? Like I don't have every single SB out there, but um, which I don't need every one of them. But uh, you got to break them in uh, when you first get them. Uh, they stiff AF. I guess it just depends. Um. I feel like the like what I wore. I feel like my most comfortable SB that I have is probably my Habibis, but like even that, like I wore Habibis last year to SneakerCon LA, and bro, dude, my feet were freaking hurting. And let me tell you guys something, okay? My New Balance heads would be like, I told you, Raph. I wore uh my New Balance Joe Fresh Goods, um, for the the five fifties, the five fifty Joe Fresh Goods, uh, New Balances, bro. My feet did not hurt at all during second day of SneakerCon LA. Like my, it was, it was a very comfortable sneaker for sure. But yeah, I wore SBs all day. The first day, golly, bro. I could barely walk because my feet were hurting so bad. I just bought wasted your, um, I just bought wasted your SB for $1,225. So you can want to beat those, uh, those daily. I mean, there's a couple SBs that you could grab almost damn real retail or under 200 bucks. Like there's Adobe SB dunk lows that people forgot about. Um, the gum bottom pack, a lot of those are under 200 bucks. The Polaroids are under 200 bucks, I think. There's a lot of, like, a lot of SBs that are super affordable. Because, like, I feel like, you know, of course, everyone wants the most limited stuff. Like, you know, and stuff that, like, are pretty exclusive. But, like, there's a lot of SBs out there that are super affordable that you could still wear on them beat uh, on the daily basis. And I'm telling you guys, those gum bottom packs are, like, stupid, stupid underrated. Because it's a great shoe. Um, you need a 990 V5s. Those are most comfortable new balances. Okay. V-Ball, I appreciate that. What's up, Raph? My JD status pre-order canceled on a size 11 Polyninos. What should I do? Um, just go for another one, bro. If it canceled, bro, just, just go for another one. F it, man. And you know what? If you have a $20 coupon for finish line and JD sports, listen, bro, you could use that. You could use that to your next, uh, for your purchase today. Um, NCNIV, thank you so much for the five. Kabigan, did you get email from Union about shipment? Salamat fam. Um, so what up, what up, pare? I already got my unions in today, bro. I got my unions in today. Or yesterday. Uh, shout out to my boy. Thank you so much, pare. Appreciate you. Wearing, I'm wearing pants, guys. I'm wearing pants this morning because it's kind of cold. Got my unions in, in here, fire. See? Dude. Do my box <laughs> yesterday, yesterday on uh TikTok stream. I'm down bad, bro. Look at this shit. I freaking tripped over my box yesterday in the room and I freaking cracked my freaking box. Which whatever, I don't give a shit, right? Like, but I cracked my box on the back side of this shoe and <laughs> and uh I'm down bad. I freaking fell over it because I forgot I I was like once I was done after my TikTok stream, I started walking backwards and I just fell over it and I cracked it, but whatever. But we got this shoe right here. 
Kabayan, did you get email from Union about shipment? Ah, uh, well, here it is. Sam. Um, let's talk about how New Balance is way overpriced. Last, let's, let's be honest, Rafi. Um, I mean, dude, I rarely wear New Balances, so I wouldn't know the price points. I feel like with with New Balance, like it's like around what 180 to 200 bucks. All right, here we go. Make sure you guys hit that like button. Let's get to 100 likes real quick, guys. I know it's Saturday. A lot of you guys are dragging out of bed. Some of you guys haven't brushed your teeth this morning. But it's all good. So we got this. Bad boy. Such a nice shoe, dude. So you guys. This shoe right here. Look at this. God. This shoe right here is beautiful, bro. I don't know how you guys don't like this shoe. Come on now. What up, Nolan? Look at that. Mm. Like, look at, look, see, like, look at the details, bro. Man. I don't care what anyone says, bro. This shoe's so fire. <laughs> look at this. Like, look at that. Beautiful. These are nice, bro. Yeah, so like the quality is good. Like I just how like how different it is. Like it's just like people really don't like this. Like it's honestly not a big deal, bro. Like you guys, some of you guys want something different from Jordan Brand and Nike. You guys, some of you guys complain like Nike be coming out with the same stuff. You feel me? Like this is just so different going around the the mud guard. They just look good, bro. Like, I, I, me personally, I love the colorway. They don't come with, like, they only come with the, these laces right here. But, like, if they came with this colored lace, oh, my gosh. I think if they came out with this colored, you see this color right here that's, like, on the stitching. If they came out with that colorway, and, it, oh, I think this would have been, like, it would have, it would have popped. It would have easily popped in the shoe. It's all, yeah, it's a lot better in hand for sure. I feel like in hand, they look really, really good. What up, Eric? Guess what? What up, Eric? Let's let's try them on feet. Stop trying. It's average. What are you talking about, Aries? Why can't I just why can't I just like things, bro? You guys call me a hype beast, bro, and shit like that. But like the shoe doesn't even go for much, dude. The shoe goes for almost dead damn retail. See? So I got bricks. I got bricks in my freaking sneaker collection. Damn, these run. These are crazy. All right, let's see. I'm not going to lace them up all the way, but. I guess I got to, I got to, I got to find the right. I mean, I don't know if these are the right pants to wear, but they look pretty good. What do you guys think? I don't know if it's, these are the right pants to wear. These are nice. What do you guys think? Thoughts? Don't mind my freaking beat up chair. Yeah, these are nice. Imagine if they were low tops, dude. It's, uh, uh, since you're on IG. Uh, clean, yeah. They look good with these pants. Yeah, I, I like them. I like them. Low tops, you know, these are, these are not. I think if, like, just guys give it a chance. Like, if you see these in hand, I feel like you guys will like this low bit more. If these were a low top, I think they go hard, too. <laughs> I 
that stitching matches. Uh, you know what I realized when I got this shoe in? Is that like they have the distressed tongue. I like the distressed tongue on it. Timmy should be happy that they're finally a Jordan 1 union in the uh, price range, but still gonna uh, complain. Yeah, facts, dude. Like, dude, like if you guys look at the original colorways of the union Jordan 1s, like they go for like over a thousand dollars, dude. Like the fact that we could get a union Jordan 1 high for this price. Dude, come on now. The colorway is perfect. Watch them take off like uh, the black cats. <laughs> and then everyone's, oh, I like Union Jordan. <laughs> <coughs> as long as you like them, Raph, they're not uh, for me, though. Yeah, they're, they're not for everybody, right? I, I could understand. I could completely understand why people would, wouldn't like the uh, the woven, right? I could completely understand, right? The woven is different, bro. Like. The woven is really, really different, but I just don't think it's a big deal. That's that's all I'm saying. I don't think it's a big deal. I just think it's different. Um, I like what Jordan Brand and Nike did to this. Uh, like you still have like really great like leather on the upper of this sneaker. Like even on the toe box, like leather all around is just perfect. Um, no no quality controls, no nothing. But then you just have this random woven material that goes across the scene i just think it's just different you know what i'm saying like it's a great colorway i love like the my favorite part of the shoe even though it's not like nothing crazy is that teal green stitching that goes across man like man it just it just goes it just goes together perfectly so i won't i won mine yesterday there you go there you go stretch um uh, it's built different mine one yours yesterday. So what would everyone thought be if they did uh they did the stitching on the Jordan 4? Watch that be the next drop. I, I don't think so. I could see them dropping another colorway on this shoe. Um, like if it was like depending on the colorway too, like there was just more like I don't mind the woven. The reason why I like this shoe so much is because the colorway. Like that was one reason. Like I love the silver. I love this, like the the gray uh, and white cream laces that they came with. I love how they they distressed the tongue, um, and I like the woven on it. So it's actually really really cool. If they came out this with a Chicago colorway, someone's like, "Yo, Raph, if they came out with this a Chicago colorway, you think people would change their mind?" Of course, because people love people like the shoe because of the colorway, um, and, and the silhouette. I like everything about the shoe except the woven part. If they had released it without the woven aspect, I would have uh, it would have done uh, it would have done better. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. Like I, I get why people wouldn't like that woven. Like I totally get it. Like people just want give me a, a just a basic Jordan one high with good premium material and, and you know a simple you know basic colorway that you it could be uh, you know wearable, which I I could see that as well. You just got to style them right. Uh, they grow on people once they see it on feet. Post them yesterday, Raph. I did see that, I think, Luno. You wore like a... Uh, I think you wore the uh, Richie Lee green pants with it, right? <clears throat> with a black shirt. I think I seen that. I think I seen that. Uh, yeah, uh, slap in teal laces. Dude, if you had teal... If they had teal extra laces with this, but they only come with the um, the these laces right here. Like, these laces are not too bad. And remember the whole conspiracy about the laces when, like, early pairs start to surface? Like, there was, like, pairs that had, like, the bag, like, the the the, the Ziploc bag uh, laces and then the, the cardboard. It looks like Nike is switching to cardboard holding to hold the extra laces in. So, there was a lot of conspiracy about that. So, I, no one, I don't know. I think everyone just forgot about that. It's like... Do you guys remember? Do you guys remember that with the with the bag laces or the the cardboard laces? I don't freaking know. No, they were um, the new car, uh, the eight and eight and nine new cargos. But I'll do uh, Richie next time. Okay. No, I mean regardless, the pants look good, bro. The pants look really, really good. Like they looked really good. Uh, yellow laces make it pop. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, people ask me if I was gonna use the yellow laces. I don't think I will. I don't think I will. I, I really don't. I think I'm just going to keep it the way it looks like. So, you know how many people thought Yeezys are are ugly when they first came out, like 450s or 380s, but yet they sold out and look way better on on on, on feet? Yeah. They haven't uh, done bags in over a year. Yeah, we, I haven't seen any bags of extra laces in a while. 
Rafi, it's nice. It's a nice shoe. It's just that I thought it would wouldn't be able would be in mine rota in minor rotation a lot, so I didn't go for them. Ah, oh, it's all good, bro. Kevon, it's all Gucci. Listen, people always ask my opinion and like yo raf what's your opinion about this shoe and i give my opinion but i don't want people's opinion i don't want people to think my like i don't want people buying or not buying a shoe because of my opinion right you buy this shoe because you genuinely like this sneaker okay so i always try to i always try to keep it that way because like people sometimes be buying sneakers because i'd be like yeah i like it oh well, Rafi says he likes it i like it too like no bro like have your own opinion you feel like me i still think yeezys are ugly it's all good everyone has their own opinions like it's like the same thing with my dad like i've talked about this numerous times numerous times like my dad likes adidas clothes but he refuses to wear any yeezys my dad hates yeezys like he genuinely hates yeezy and he will never give 350 v2 a chance none of them i've told i i've showed my dad so many like yeezy slides foam runners 350 v2s 700s dude my dad refuses to put an adidas yeezy on his feet like he just can't do it he just can't do it he just refuses but he, he's willing to wear all their clothes like that's just like my dad that's my dad my dad you know my dad he's an og yeah uh around early pair reviews can't wait uh until i get mines immediately on foot uh on unions yeah like I need to start. I might have to spray some stuff on this. Um, this is obviously a shoe that I can't be wearing during the fall and winter time here in Seattle because it's going to start to rain a whole lot. So this is definitely a shoe I probably won't wear till probably like next year spring or maybe it's like sunny out. I'd probably break these in. But these shoes are amazing. Ravi, I'm here in DSG Red for signups. I'm here outside, first in line. I'll keep you updated. Okay. I feel like the um the locations would have been it would have been went live right. I feel like locations would have went live. I know my DSG told me that they were doing signups, but they didn't, they wouldn't tell me. I think it could be today. I wouldn't be surprised if it is or not. Um, put a pair on uh, the Quantums on feet and don't tell him uh, what they are. Oh, my dad knows, bro. Like my dad's been search. My dad searches up like a bunch of sneakers a lot, and he'd be like, "Yo, what are these? Like, what are these? What are these? Like, he knows what Quantums are." Uh, I don't mess with Yeezy either. My unions arrive um, eight, uh, September 8th before Sneakers Day. There you go. They go live in 15 minutes. Okay. I thought normally they go live at 5 in the morning, but we'll see what happens in, in 15 minutes for sure. Wear the slides and that's it. Yeah. Uh, wear those uh, stomps in the uh, puddle. I heard they're uh, the weatherproof. Is this for the Palominos? Yes. If anybody is wondering about stock numbers, these are for the Palominos. Feel free to let me know if you want me to scroll up or down, okay? These are basically the entire stock for the shoe, and I'm going to wish everyone the best of luck if you guys are going for the shoe right here. Um, I think a lot of these sizes are definitely going to be, um, you know, sitting regardless. Uh, some bigger, obviously bigger size will sell out. Size 12 will sell out. 11 and a half will sell out. 12 and a half, 13, 14. Like the last size that will possibly sell out is probably uh, a size 10 through probably size nine and a half through an 11. Cause dude, there's over 20,000 pairs on each of those sizes. Uh, they are most definitely going to for under retail. What these Palominos, you think these Palominos are going to go under retail? Um, tips for reselling, uh, sneakers, bro. Tips for reselling sneakers, bro. Tips on reselling sneakers. Uh, have good clientele, bro. You know? Have some good clientele. Stay consistent, you know. Whenever you, uh, you know, I just feel like I don't know. I maybe I maybe I give bad advices when it comes to like reselling advice. I just feel like it's like the same thing with anything with your business. You have to have some good clientele. You got to sell yourself, bro. Okay, give some give people deals under market. You know, don't don't like overprice your your prices. Like give out deals. You know, at first. So you're, you know, you're bringing in some clientele, like, you know, clients are going to come to you all the time. If you're giving up deals, you know, say if a shoe is going for like 350 bucks and you sell it for like 330 or under market, like maybe $20 under market and you still make money. Dude, people are going to keep coming to you, bro. You're like, man, I don't want to pay over, uh, over, uh, right up market. My boy got me under like $20 under $30 under market. I'm going to do that. So he's most likely to go back to you. I feel like clientele is definitely important when it comes to selling shoes. Uh oh, dude, dude, my daughter scared the shit out of me. Come on, mama. What's wrong? Why are you crying? 
Come on, you need to go back to bed, okay? Give me a second, chat. Ooh, dude, I'm telling you guys, now that, <laughs> dude, now that I'm home, like, now that I'm home, like, like, my kids are not used to seeing me every single day throughout the week, and the last two weeks, and I've been, like, really home every single day the last two weeks, dude, my kid, my, my youngest daughter has been so attached to me, like, it's, like, it's crazy, like, she follows me everywhere, bro, like, everywhere, when I say everywhere, like, dead ass everywhere like she's literally on my hip <laughs> like everywhere i go so she's she's definitely this definitely a, attached pretty quickly once i now that she knows i'm home uh hey dub to you raf for being a good dad it's all good she's like she's like i'm looking for you i'm looking for you all right buddy you gotta go bed um apologize chat but make sure you guys hit that like button. I appreciate it. Uh, I sent to you on IG. Eric, you, uh, I can't pull up on IG here. What did you send me? Retail or no sell? For me, I don't uh, knock the hustle, but market creates demand. Yeah. Uh, enjoy it while it lasts. When uh, she's a teen, she'll be like, get away from me. Yeah. I know, dude. Like, I'm preparing myself for like, my. Old, that was my youngest daughter that woke up. But my, right, my oldest daughter, uh, Rose, like she starts school next week and I, I don't think her mom's prepared for it. I know her mom's going to get so emotional on like the first day of school, but you know, I, I've, <laughs> I've definitely like realized that how excited like my daughter is for school, which is awesome. Cause like, dude, you see a bunch of kids crying and shit like that in the first day of school. And like, and then you got my kid that's just so motivated, <laughs> uh, October next month. Hope she tries to scare you every chance she gets when you're, uh, when you're streaming, dude, she, this one, she kind of scared me because it's unusual that like, she wakes up at this time. Literally, my two-year-old son, LOL. Yeah, I'm a cop and L on the size six. No, you're good, man. Like, size six, 1,665. I mean, you're not wrong. That's not a lot of pairs. But just to let you know, there's a size six men's, and you could go for a size six uh, youth as well. So only 1,665 in stock, yeah. Uh, ain't no alarm clock for children. Yeah, W Dad, W Fam. Asad, thank you so much, bro um enjoy these days they grow up fast yeah bro it's crazy man like me and me and the wifey we really want another kid like we absolutely do want another kid like we want three like i think i think i've come to realize that i want three of my babies but i mean right now where my situation is right now i think i'm settled with two right now but i would love to have a a a, a third a third one not sure what you guys have done with uh, your teen daughters. Mine are forever daddy's girls. Don't believe that, Raph. I mean, I guess it just depends. You know what I'm saying? I mean, every kid is different, right? Personalities start to change. They, you know, they build their own character. So, I mean, it is what it is, man. Um, how's the sizing for the Palominos? I feel like any Jordan 1, bro, you got to go true to size. Any Jordan 1 high, you go true to size, bro. You should be fine. I always go true to size with my sneakers. Um, there's there's never really a, a, a time where I have to change my size on a Jordan 1 high or a low, uh, respectfully. I feel like every single Jordan 1 high that I've had in the past has always been true to size. So if you want to go a half size down, I mean, it's up to you. I wouldn't recommend it. Just go a true to size. I think you should be good. I mean, you could ask chat. Um, chat, what do you guys would or what what are you guys going? Do you guys go true to size on Jordan 1 highs? Do you guys go a half size up? Do you guys go half size down? Um, you guys let us know in the chat. It'll that probably help some people in the chat, but I feel like it you know you guys, you guys should know your foot more than anybody else. So if you have a Jordan 1 high in your in your sneaker collection, then that's the size that you should go with. Raf, are you going for these? Uh I already I'm picking up a pair today, Adam. What up, Adam? Appreciate you tapping in, bro. How you doing? Um my boys have grown into daddy's boys. There you go, Ra. There you go, bro. Kicknology, what up, my guy? Blessings, bro. That's my boy, Kicknology, in the building, man. The OG himself, Kicknology. It's Kicknology. 
my boy what's good bro bless up chat blessings rap what up Corey? what's good man how you doing man see everyone's saying true to size definitely true to size in the jordan one highs i think you should be okay with it um there's no reason why you should go a half size up unless you have a really really wide foot uh but even that i feel like jordan one highs regardless they fit true <coughs> hearing rumors is retail is 180 or 220 no it should be 100 uh 180 $180 for this sneaker. And you know what's crazy? I you would think that Jordan brand would put this at like 180 or excuse me at 200 bucks, but yeah, the shoe is 180. Um and that's what it is. The Palominos. Palominos Jordan 1 highs is going to be $180, my friend. <clears throat> my union just shipped out today. There you go. Morning wrap. I haven't joined uh this week because of work, but it's the weekend. Sneaker and stripes. There you go. I feel like a lot of you guys got a three-day weekend, huh? Anybody in here have a three-day weekend? Anybody? I have a three. I mean, obviously I don't have a three-day weekend. My wife, my my wifey does, but yeah, three-day weekend for a lot of you guys, I think. I think it's la it's Labor Day weekend. How you like the unions, Raph? Dexter, I love the unions, bro. I love the unions. I don't, I don't know if I'll put this in my top five because right now my top five, okay, guys, listen, this could be potentially my, my top five has been changing out through the, the last couple of weeks, but um, my top five right now, I, I mentioned this on Rahus' stream yesterday, I would say sneaker of the year for me, and I'm going to keep the same energy is the white cement Jordan threes. That's my number one. All right. My number one is white cement threes. Number two, Travis Lowe Olives. Um, is my second just because that's my most worn sneaker this year is my Travis Lowe's. Ever since I've gotten them, I wear them almost every single, like maybe I would say like three times a week I'm wearing them. Um, number three, I think I'm going to put the Udos up there. I think that's like one of probably the best SB out of all SBs that dropped this year. In my personal opinion, that's my favorite. Um, number four, I'm going to go ahead and put the... What did I put? I think I might put the Air Jordan 1 Satin Breads. I told you guys, ever since that stream that we did yesterday, and I looked up to more videos and, and, and you know more pictures of the Satin Jordan 1 Highs, that one's exclusive. Low-key, that's going to be my, my number four in my sneaker collection that I, I really want. I, 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 I kind of want those Satin Breads in a double up, bro. <coughs> I really do. I really do. And what did I put in number five? My number five is going to be the Reverse Grinches. I need those, okay? I have I have the GGs, but those reverse Grinches, I just, for some reason, I just love them so much. So, I know there's a lot of shoes out there that I could pick for my top five, but I kind of narrowed it down um, to those fives of sneakers, you know what I'm saying? So, um, I think that's a pretty good list, in my opinion, for overall, like, shoes that I really like this year. That is definitely going to be my top five. So, number one, White Cement 3s. Number two, Travis Low Olives. Number no, excuse, number two, Travis Olives. Number three, Udos. Number four, Jordan One Satins. And then number five is the reverse Grinches. Uh, are you still planning on copping Udos resale? Most likely. Stinking Burrow. Most likely. Um, most likely for sure. I'll probably buy them next month. Probably just treat them for my birthday. Because my birthday is actually this month. So I'll probably buy them for just my birthday. Just treat myself and say F it. Pay resale for it. I'm wearing your number one uh, at the casino right now. There you go, King. The white cement Jordan 3s. I love the cement 3s, but the SB 4s are number one. Yeah, I feel like most people are going to put Jordan 4 SBs as number one, but it's not, I, I'm, I'm not putting that shoe as my number one. No way. Should I try uh, to buy them now for Risa or just test my luck with a drop? Um... Should I buy these for resale? Why don't you, well, Justin? You talking about the Palominos? My, me personally, bro. Like, there's no reason why you should pay resale now. Like, I mean, the shoe is about to drop in like an hour. You feel me? Like, give yourself a chance, man. You feel me? And then maybe consider paying resale. If you're talking about the Palominos, bro, yeah, like, <laughs> bro. Don't don't pay resale now, bro. Wait, you got so many you got so many stores that are gonna be dropping them this morning. You got Finish Line, you got JD Sports, you got Hibbit Sports, you got Sneakers App, you got you got Snipes USA, you got DTLR, you got so many sites that you could go to this morning to grab a pair. And I feel like if you actually try and, and you know go on these websites and try, you'll hit for retail, bro. There's no reason why you should pay like. 40 50 dollars over re retail just to grab these for the toe like give yourself a chance man 
Um, September gang, my birthday is the fifth. There you go, Wayne. Happy happy early birthday to you, Wayne. Happy early birthday, man. Hopefully, you have a great weekend. Uh, under retail, maybe at outlets, easy cop. I mean, one hundred ninety three thousand, man. I hope a lot of people is gonna hit. So, um, K Way says easy cop. I think it's only an easy cop if you put in the extra work, man. Like if you put in the footwork for the shoe, you should be fine. Right. If you put in the extra footwork this morning, you should be OK for grabbing these at retail price. I literally missed my reservation time at Full Locker by two minutes. That's a mage. Oh, man. Don't you hate that, Sir Harry? Like just missing your reservation. That's just annoying. Happy birthday, Jermaine. Happy birthday, Jermaine. Double up already. Low key. I kind of um, thought the stock numbers were going to be higher. Uh, I mean, I mean, the stock numbers make sense to me, I guess. 193. I feel like that's an average of stock numbers is like over 150k for general releases for Jordan ones or any other Jordans. But uh, Jermaine, happy birthday, bro! Hopefully you have a great weekend, man. That's awesome. Um, stay safe. Get ready to hit that uh, the mall to grab my Palominos from Finish Line. Swimming through the void. Congratulations, my friend. Huge dub today. Clots came out with the uh, the Jordan Five Low with 250 pairs. Okay. Uh, when is Union going to ship my Jordan ones? Uh, Melvin, just stay patient. Uh, mine just got in yesterday. Um, some people got their notification that they got shipped out soon. You'll get them soon, bro. Like I said, uh, Union Union is shipping them out in waves, and that's what it looks like. There's like shipping a good amount, like every single week. Um, you gotta realize probably how much inventory they actually have. What's your birthday? Mine's September 29th. Libra gang. Uh, mine's on the 24th. Mine's on the 24th. Uh, my birthday is on the 4th. Shout out to all the September birthdays. There you go. Happy birthday. Your birthday's in two days, my guy. You're right, bro. I didn't hit on the uh, raffles. It's all good, Justin. Did you review, uh, receive your white forces raft? No, I have not, bro. Uh, that is one that I'm still looking for. Uh, but, I mean, eventually, uh, hopefully they can land. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. My full locker didn't get the shipment, so they uh, canceled the, the entry. <coughs> I got my unions in today. There you go. Real... Oh my gosh, what is up with your name? Do you have to sign up? For, uh, do you have to sign for unions? Dude, okay, so, okay, let me explain to you guys. So, my unions came in yesterday. Thank you so much for reminding me. So, my unions came in yesterday, okay? I, I took a nap yesterday because I was like, you know what? I, I, I set the location to pick up, right? So, I told you guys that, you know, they were going to be out for delivery, but I end up changing my uh, pickup. It let me actually change it to in store pickup. But guess what? Here, here's the catch. My my girl woke me up from that nap. She's like, "Hey, your you, FedEx is at your mom's door." Um, and I said, "Okay." Uh, did they take the box with them? Did they drop it off? And my girl was like, "No, they took it with them." So I was like, <clears throat> "I was like, okay." I woke up, you know, did my you know routine, brushed my teeth, whatever, got ready because I I had to I had to go to work to sign out and everything. But anyways, I looked at my mom's ring camera. And it shows that he put the shoe down on the porch. So I was telling my girl, I was like, I thought he he never dropped the box. He never dropped the box off. And he she was like, he he took the box with him. I was like, ain't no way, because I went to go look at the tracking and it signed it, it said it was already signed for. So I went back and I looked at the camera closely, and the guy actually put it behind my mom's plant. Cause there's like a big ass plant in front of my mom's porch. So like he put it behind there. And my FedEx guy is always goaded, bro. Like he's super cool. And I let him know, be like, hey, if you if I get any shipment in, can you can you put it behind this plant? I let him know. And he's oh, he does it all the time, right? And I seen that he put it behind the plant and he signed for it. So I didn't have to sign anything, which is cool, but not cool because then like what if like he signed for it and I never received the shoe? It's like, hello, you feel me? But he obviously he's been super goaded about it. He put it behind my mom's plant somewhere. You can't really see it. And he signed for it, um, which was awesome. So I didn't really have to like, cause I changed granted. I told you guys, I changed the location pickup, but then, you know, obviously it, it didn't work. So, I mean, I got my pair. That's all that matters. You know, I could have easily had to go freaking track down on it, but he was kind of goaded and kind of put it behind where it's supposed to be. And I got the sneaker. So that's my story behind that. Um, could have got it snatched. Yeah, for real. If I had, if I had not looked at the camera closely, then like I would have been freaking out. Be like, bro, he took my package. There's no, what the hell? I never signed for it. Cause I looked at the tracking, like I said, and it said it was already signed for. Uh, but that, yeah, that was definitely nice of him. Uh, it's always the same driver every single time. 
Uh, he's super cool. Uh, never had a problem with my FedEx drivers uh, at all. So uh, I was pretty stoked about that. Um, I need the MX foam runners. Uh, two unions, two Palominos isn't uh, too shabby. There you go, Rafi. You need to hook that guy up for a Christmas or something. You know, maybe I should. Maybe I should start doing that. Maybe I should give a gift card. Dude, like being a delivery driver, bro, it, it, it sucks, bro. Like I could understand like... Like being the delivery driver for like FedEx and UPS, bro. I feel like even during the winter time, bro, like that sucks. So I might, I might have to do something nice for them. Give them like a, you know, a twenty dollars gift card for like, you know, Christmas. Kind of motivate them a little bit. I don't know. That's what my mom does sometimes. My mom will give them something time to time. Um, <laughs> y'all think I can uh, walk into a retailer for these, or should I try to hit on sneakers? I hate ordering things online. Um, I mean, I get, I get it, but. Uh, I don't know if, I don't know. What do you guys think, chat? You guys think these are, I don't think those will, I don't think these will sit in store. I don't think these will sit in store. Do you guys think Palominos are going to sit in store? I don't think they are. I don't think they are. I don't know. Uh, NBA youth, uh, young boy, is it Werner? Um, I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think, chat? Do you guys think this will sit? Yeah, think this will sit? My mom will give them lumpia. Any foams uh, soon? I'm not sure anything about Yeezy right now. UPS about to pay these uh, guys over a hundred k. I got two pairs of Palominos. Do you think I will be able to make some uh, profit? Um, I mean, listen, bro. I, I don't know what they're going for in the resale market right now. <sighs> I don't know, bro. I don't know. People don't even have pairs in hand, bro. I don't know if these are going to touch right at retail. Bro, just go for the toe. F it, dude. Just go for the shoe for the toe. All right? No saying. It's crazy different down here in Alabama. My shit gets stolen from FedEx near Memphis. UPS is clutch every time. Yeah, everyone has different experiences, bro. Like, everybody has different experiences. They really do. Not everybody has the same experience when it comes to UPS. Like, does anybody still use laser ship? Question. Does anybody in here use laser ship? Like... I haven't heard laser ship in a long time. Anybody gets their stuff uh, shipped from laser ship? Because it's been a minute since I've heard anyone complain about laser ship. Did they, did they like shut down the company or some shit? Because I haven't heard from them, from you guys in like dead ass a year. Everything doesn't need to be uh, for resale. Exactly, Sir Harry. Uh, they're sitting in Canada. I have. Okay. Roy, what up, man? Facts, laser ship. No, laser ship is the worst. Yeah, I haven't heard from laser ship in a minute from you guys. It's been like a year, I think. Because I remember like last year, like, no, they shut down over here. Okay. You mean laser shit? Oh, no. My loss in noise and uh, they lost my noise aqua dunks. Oh, man. 60, 100 plus, 600 plus, and they only have 100 likes. What? Yes, sir. Make sure you guys run it up if you guys don't mind. Smack that like button. We're going to go here uh, live on TikTok here shortly. Uh, FedEx steals everything. Laser ship doesn't even use laser ship. I just got some Adidas orders from laser ship last week. Okay. It's just cause I haven't heard from you guys talking about laser ship. Like I heard like do laser ship. Like I think I've gotten one thing shipped out from laser ship and that was from shoe palace. That was last year on one of the easy slide drops and they shipped out they shipped out by using laser ship. And I was like, man, all this experience people are having. I'm kind of concerned for my pair when they they ship out my pair so i don't know i haven't heard of blade strip in a while only issues i have to use nike is that they they have uh sealed boxes i know you have probably said it a hundred times but what is the stock numbers on the palominos hello uh nathan they're on the screen bro One hundred they they're on the screen my friend they're on the screen Nathan, they're on the screen. I work at the uh, Nike and I still uh, see laser ship uh, shipping labels. My loss and uh, they lost my stuff from Old Navy for my daughter. Oh, man. Laser ship stolen packages during, uh, depending on your location. You are uh, scaring me. My Supreme Dunk Lows are supposed to ship today in the afternoon from FedEx. Ah, no. yo, don't, don't listen. This is just based off experience, bro. Listen. I had, listen, I'm going to knock on wood because I've never had any bad experiences with any delivery drivers. Dead ass. None. I worked for uh, UPS. Okay, there we go. Um, 
Yeah, I know it's Saturday, guys. Guys, listen, it, it's Saturday. I totally understand. All right, it's knock on wood. Nine been uh and been using uh, FedEx and UPS laser uh labor ship stolen these five pairs from me. Oh no, that's not good. There's enough pairs even for the grandparents. Facts, bro. All right, make sure you guys hit that like button. Let's run it up to 200 likes, bro. I need some water, bro. My dude, I don't know what's going on with me this morning. I think it's just the weekend, man. But make sure you guys. Hit that like button. I greatly appreciate you guys for coming through. Thank you guys so much for being active in the chat as well. I'm hoping a lot of you guys are having an amazing weekend. Um, Three-day weekend, man. A lot of you guys, three-day weekend. Let me get some water. Guys, dude, water is so good. Water is so freaking good. You got any stock number for the GS pairs? Of course I do, bro. You want stock number for the GS, bro? Of course, man. I got you. My bad. My fault. Yeah, I got stock numbers for GS. Shout out to my boy uh, Casanova for these. Once again, always helping out the collection family, as always, man. Always coming in and clutch with stock numbers for you guys. But there it is for GS if you're interested. Uh, that is GS, 31,000. GS sizing, I think, will most likely sell out for sure. GS sizing will sell out this morning. Okay. I uh, got the red cement fours in yesterday. How do you like them? Yo, uh, big... Kukua? Kahuna? Golly. Well, how do you like them? No sneakers pass. There was no sneakers pass. If there was a sneakers pass for the Palominos, that would have went down yesterday. But there was no sneakers pass. I worked at UPS loading trucks. I would recommend I would recommend people to chew bricks before they work there. You gotta work like a year before they let you drive in the drive the trucks. Dude, I don't know if I could be a delivery driver, bro. All right. I, I personally I don't think I'd be a delivery driver, bro. That's a lot of that's a lot of hassle. You got to deal with all of those people's packages. Try to double up on these Palominos today. There you go Roy. Good luck, man. I'm pretty sure you'll be able to do it, man. I'm sure you'll be able to double up on this sneaker for sure. I'm about to grab uh about to go grab my pairs from JD and Champs. There you go. Anybody picking up a pair today in store? Let me know in the chat. Is anybody picking up a pair in store for the air? Jordan won Palominos this morning, guys. Let me know in the chat. Let me know. We're going to go live on TikTok real quick. Live cop Palominos. Here we go. Live cop. I got to go live on TikTok. Live cop. Here we go. Uh, Effects. Green screen. Boom. Bam. There it is. I'm going to go live real quick. <clears throat> UPS or FedEx, who you trust? I mean, dude, depending on your area, depending on your area, bro. It all depends on your area, man. Picking up from two stores right here after I double up on, on the app. There you go. What time is it on East Coast? It's 9 a.m. What time does your guys' mall even open? What time does your guys' mall open? My mall opens not till freaking 11, bro. I might go, I might buy some, some, I might buy some Pokemon later, bro. Dead ass. Oh, gosh. How did my phone just fall down like that, bro? Are you serious? There it goes. Oh my gosh, I'm down bad. There it goes. Yes, sir. Two pairs. There we go. Uh, if I go out of my city, they're not in sneaker stores. And in Spain, I don't know any of the shops to buy where. 11 a.m. Yeah, my, my store is open at 11 a.m. Good morning, TikTok. Appreciate anybody that's coming through on TikTok. What's good, everybody? I'm live on YouTube right now, so I apologize if I can't see both. Uh, I got from Finish Line and Full Locker. Got from okay, there you go. It's already open. <laughs> Kali, look, we got a FedEx driver on the in the in the chat, bro. I'm weak. Where can I pre-order 151? Uh, El Migos, you can pre-order at uh, Best Buy, Best Buy, GameStop. You can go in store as well. Yo, we got a FedEx driver in the chat, bro. We literally got a FedEx driver in the chat. Literally. Literally. Yes, if I take an L on sneakers, I uh, called most stores and they stocked. Should be no issue on copping today. Yeah. What up, everybody? Appreciate you guys all pulling up from TikTok. Uh, hey, Raph, do you ever wonder why Nike went from using UPS to FedEx? I prefer UPS. 
Um, I mean, it just depends. I mean, honestly, it just depends, bro. It honestly just depends. Like, it, in your area, like, for me, like, I prefer FedEx. I like FedEx over UPS. I don't know. I don't know your guys' favorite delivery drivers. You guys let me know. Is your favorite UPS, FedEx, or USPS? Like, what do you guys prefer? You guys let me know in the chat on TikTok as well. We got 100 people on TikTok. Appreciate you guys tapping in. We got the Air Jordan 1 Palominos dropping this morning on the Nike Sneakers app. You guys let me. When you guys buy things online, what do you guys prefer? Do you guys prefer, do you guys prefer UPS, USPS, FedEx, LaserShip? Dude, let me tell you. What's the uh, the overseas? What do they use overseas? What do they use overseas? Good morning, TikTok. What's good? If you guys are in here from TikTok, make sure you guys drop a follow. Appreciate you guys all tapping in. If anybody's going for the Polyminos this morning on TikTok, good luck to you guys. All right. We're live on we're live on YouTube right now. If you guys want to check us out at Rafi Collects. All right. We got 200 people on TikTok, guys. You know what I'm saying? What's good? Rafi, did your Supreme Dunk shipped out yet? Yes. They shipped out yesterday. DHL, bro. DHL is one of the best shipping, um, bro. Ser seriously. Hey, man. Say, man. What's good, Ollie? DHL, bro. DHL is like quick, bro. For some reason, like that shit is. Yeah, DHL is the best. <laughs> yeah, dude. The fact that DHL, like you get shit shipped out overseas, that dude, they ship out within like two to three days that's i don't know what they use or what they do bro they got people constantly working 24 hours of the day you feel me <laughs> run up the likes yes sir hey if you guys are new here for the tiktok let's get 10 new followers if you guys don't mind there's about 200 of you guys here at the tiktok platform thank you guys so much and good luck to you guys if you guys going for the palominos uh rafi what happens if they haven't shipped out yet uh you're talking about what supreme or union what are you talking about? What are you talking about on that? They dropped on finish line too. Yeah, finish line. All right, so where to cop these shoes this morning? Finish line, JD Sports are going to be dropping this morning. Finish line, JD Sports. Sneakers app, of course. Snipes Q should go live here in 15 minutes. So what up, user? What's good? Good morning. FedEx uh, did take my package to, to, uh, to my neighbors twice. DHL is what Off-White uses. That shit is on point. It really is, bro. I remember hitting on the Off-White website, RPK, on the Jordan 2s. Bro, I got that shipment in like within like less than a week, bro. I was like, man, dude, they are so quick. And came all the way from what? Italy, I think? It came all the way from Italy. Shit's crazy. Morning, Raph, you think these will sit out, sell out even with the high stock? Yes. If anybody needs stock numbers, stock numbers are 193,000. 193,000 in stock numbers this morning. 193,000. What are those ones behind you called? The Palominos, bro. The Air Jordan 1 Palominos. They are going to be dropping today on the Nike Sneakers app. Once again at 10 a.m. Eastern time. So they're going to be dropping here in 45 minutes. All right. Best place to cop these shoes is Finish Shine, JD Sports, and the Sneakers app is going to be your best bet. That is where that is the best bet to uh, cop these shoes for retail. Uh, smash that like button for Rafi. Show support. Our road to 100K. Yes, sir. If you guys don't mind, leave a like. Let's get to 200 likes real quick. Smash that like button. If you guys are new here, subscribe up to the channel. All right. Subscribe up to the channel if you guys are new here, man. Subscribe up. Do highs fit like lows? I would say go true to size, bro. Go true to size. Go true to size. Go true to size. UPS driver, I stole the NBA Young Boys um, burner Supreme SB Dunks. Oh, okay, buddy. Do you think these will sit? Um, I don't think these are going to sell. I think these are going to sell out. I think these shoes are going to sell out. Best, play to, best place to cop. Uh, once again, Sneakers app, guys. Sneakers app is going to be dropping in 45 minutes. 45 minutes. These are going to be dropping, guys. 45 more minutes, guys. 45 more minutes. All right. 45 more minutes. 45, 45, 45, 45, 45, 45, 45, Black Shinobi, uh, Black Shinobi, gosh, I always forget his name, dude, all the time, Black Shinobi for the four month re-up, I paid for five gifteds, I don't know why it ain't showing up, uh oh, did it not show up, maybe YouTube is tweaking out, Maybe YouTube is tweaking out. Black Schnobly, thank you so much for the four-month re-up. Unless you're on mobile. Are you on mobile? Are you on mobile? Black Shinobi, 
once again for the four month re-up man i appreciate it yeah i don't know what's going on is youtube tweaking out this morning guys is youtube tweaking out this morning or what shinobi i know i always forget bro i it's just like i oh i don't know what's going on bro i just can't read sometimes you know um but shout out to my boy black shinobi i don't know it might be it low-key might be uh a youtube glitch because sometimes when i try to pay on my phone for donations too on other people's streams sometimes it doesn't let me donate i don't know why i was like what the heck uh chic footlocker snipes hibbit sports jd sports sneakers and finish line yes sir uh ups driver says i steal packages oh gosh let's get this w yes sir rafi where can i find the supreme jersey missed out on the other day you might have to pay resale if it's not available online you might have to pay resale you might have to pay it on StockX. um let's see uh ups driver wsf U ups driver why are you spamming bro yeah no spamming guys i'm digging the leather on the cement fours yeah the leather on the red cement fours are not bad at all the cement fours is not bad at all bro it's not a bad at all the leather quality is actually pretty decent on them really really decent it is not bad at all um <clears throat> yeah please no spamming guys i know you guys are uh i know you guys are are uh making burner accounts by being a fedex driver or ups driver please you don't have to spam okay you guys don't need to spam no need to spam guys no need to spam all right polyminos will definitely sell out oh 100 bro i think these will definitely sell out people buy for a uh, personal in order to resell they will sell out for sure yeah these are definitely going to sell out guys like I already said this before, just because, right, just because a shoe doesn't go for a lot of money doesn't mean there's no demand. Just like the, the just like the UNCs, the UNCs, the demand was there, but the resale aspect was whatever. So, bro, the frozen moments are fire. I haven't seen them in hand. I haven't seen them in hand. I haven't seen them in hand. I just don't like the red on the fours. Definitely selling out. Wouldn't be surprised if they get, um, they uh, get the loss in high, uh, found hype. Um, I don't, I personally don't think these Palominos are going to like any Jordan one. Okay. I mentioned this on tick. I think I mentioned this on TikTok yesterday is that like this shoe, like any Jordan one is not going to go for a crazy amount of numbers. Like, unless it's the lost and founds lost and founds is a, is a Jordan is a Jordan one that will, is probably the only Jordan one that it's going to hold its value because of what it is. Um, from all the recent Jordan ones that's dropped, right? So not every Jordan one is gonna be like a loss and found, right? I don't think it's gonna ever touch any loss and found prices. That's just my personal opinion, right? Unless we get like, if say if say if Jordan brand had dropped the, you know, since we're getting the bread patent leathers, right? Oh, not the patent leathers, but the satins, right? If they if they were if they were the regular Jordan one highs red ones with the leather on it then it would have been a totally different story that's how i feel about the royals right if the royals had came out with just regular leather then it would have been a different story the royals it just sucks because they're calling it they're, they're not suck but they're calling it the reimagines but the entire shoe is all suede so i think that's what really kind of turned a lot of people off about the sneaker because of the material um but like I don't know. That's just me. I feel like the shoe would have been a little bit different if they just kept it just regular leather. Then it, I feel like people would have viewed it a little bit differently. Like, imagine if they dropped the dude the twenty. Was it the twenty sixteen? <clears throat> was it the twenty sixteen or twenty fifteen? Twenty fifteen. Twenty fifteen or twenty sixteen, guys. What was it? Twenty fifteen. I think it was twenty fifteen. Twenty fifteen. Uh, bread. Uh, bread ones. Oh man, bread ones uh 2015 or 14 golly bro that was i think it was 20 ah gosh someone remind me someone remind me that that shoe was beautiful that was one of my first hits on the sneakers app bro ever in my entire lifetime was the 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 bread ones i forgot what year was it i think it's 2016 2016 or 15 was it 2016 okay 2016 that was like one of my sneaker of my ever first sneaker W's was bread ones. 2016, 2016. Okay. Chad is saying 2016, 2016. 
Yeah, that was literally one of my favorites. My favorite Jordan ones to uh to drop. That's why, like, ever since that drop, I was like, dude, bread ones is dude so clean. I couldn't believe I hit. Sub Raffi, it's been a while, bro. What up, King? What's going on? Appreciate you tapping in. Good morning to everybody. We got about 20, or excuse me, about 35 more minutes until the drop. We're live on TikTok. We're live on uh we're live on YouTube. So I appreciate you guys all tapping in. If you guys don't mind, leave a like. All right, smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new here, right? Run it up with your uh, with your boy here at Raffi Collects. I think the Palominos will be a hold uh be a hold uh and once people get them in hand and post pictures, then the demand will go up. They look like they are uh, really nice though, or li a really nice shoe. Um um let's see uh you look stupid wearing skateboarding shoes but can't kid can't kick flip i can't wait on my supreme dunks um okay um i guess we all wear jordan shoes but we can't shoot a free throw none of them raff you going for these um well i'm picking up a pair for somebody today uh so uh, i'm i guess you could call it i'm, I'm gonna have a vlog later so it's a poor man's mocha. I don't think these are poor man's mocha. If you don't have the mochas or if you don't have Travis Scott mochas, this is a perfect alternative. Um, Palominos won't, won't go up until the Jordan 1 hype comes back. Okay. What up, Kuyaraf? What up, Joseph? Y'all, you, some of you guys, like, some of you skateboarders complain too much, bro. Like, seriously. Like, who cares, bro? Seriously. <laughs> I, I listen. Guess what? I'm a skateboarder. Every single SB drop, bro. I'm a, I'm a skateboarder on every single SB drop. Okay, I'm a skateboarder on every single. Right, guys? Aren't we all skateboarders? Everybody in here is a skateboarder on every single uh, in every single freaking um, SB drop. Mocha's are a poor man's Travis. <laughs> Double dipping on JD using those coupons. There you go, bro. You might as well. It's been a while since the, the, the last time we played Fortnite. Yeah. I can't. I, I can. Uh... Wait, what? I like how the word dunk came from the with what sport. Yeah. What up, Josh? Was good. Here we go again with the, the dumb questions. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> it's all good bro if you like the shoe you like the shoe bro listen i'm gonna get my listen i'm gonna i'm gonna get my i'm gonna get my sb supremes and i'm gonna buy a skateboard from freaking uh walmart and do a kickflip with that i'm gonna buy a skateboard so everyone knows i'm a skateboarder kickflip try flip there we go i don't know i i could do an ollie is that considered hey, listen if i could do an ollie you think is that is that considered of me being a skateboarder guys if i could do an ollie if i could do an ollie is that considered that i could that i'm a skateboarder yes or no morning raft 12 miles run done this morning now let's get this dub on the ones you ran 12 miles holy shamoles this man said i ran 12 miles bro where are you are you in the east coast west coast bro that man's dedicated bro seriously this man, this man did a whole golly, bro. <laughs> people always have something to say about people wearing SB dunks. Um, don't skate. And I always say what you you said, Raph. People wear Jordans and don't hoop. Exactly, bro. Exactly. Exactly. 90% of peeps who buy Jordans don't shoot in the gym. Yeah, facts, bro. Right? We just like the shoe. It's the same thing with any other shoe. I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, quit playing with these kids. Who cares? Yeah. Right, Steve? Facts, Steve. What is dropping for Sneakers Day? We don't know yet. We'll find out. Anybody that's asking about Sneakers Day, we'll find out next week. I know 12 miles, bro. My fat ass would never do that shit. 12 mile run? Golly, bro. Bro, if I, if I ran 12, if someone told me I'm going to run 12 miles today, bro, my ass is staying home the rest of the day. If the, the teal would have been in the yellow laces, it would have been off the chain. Yeah, facts, bro. I use my uh, tech deck on uh, all, the, all the time, bro. Don't mess with my fingers. Golly. 
He's not a skater. He's just a hater. What shoe did you turn? Uh, did you run in? Uh, everyone is going for golfing soon. Facts. When the Travis golfs, you listen. When the Travis golfs drop, bro, we're all golfers, bro. Okay. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna wear my uh my Travis golf lows to the uh to the driving range. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a golfer here soon. I dip, you dip, I dip. Uh, just like flip flops wearing a a bum. What? 12 miles, bro. Call 911 because I'm dying. Oh, no. Uh, most skaters can't skate either. Skating is hard. Mostly posers. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Virto, what up, man? Good morning, everyone. Are we catching W's today. Yes, sir. Hey, let's run it up to 250 likes if you guys don't mind. Hey, if you guys are new here to the TikTok platform, make sure you guys drop a follow, man. We're on the road to 6,000 followers. So thank you guys so much. If we could get like 10 new followers here on the tiktok make sure you guys follow it up we're live right now on um youtube if anybody is wondering who i'm talking to um we are live on youtube right now um we got about like almost 700 people in the building on tiktok so if you guys want to go uh watch it on tiktok or excuse me on youtube make sure you guys go ahead and drop a follow um buy what you want skaters be hating Next time I put on a jersey for whatever sport it is, I'll be sure to try out for my local team. There you go. Um, I still have my uh, Mirakami uh, skateboard deck set, still hanging on the wall. You expect me to use it to skate? <laughs> no, no one's expecting you to use it. Why do you have? Why do you have skate? Why do you have skate decks on your wall? You don't even skate. Listen, buddy. All right. Damn, you double streaming? Yes, sir. We're streaming on TikTok and we're streaming on YouTube, bro. All right. We're doing both ways. You heard? Uh, you caught me the Palominos. Yeah, we um we uh what's it called? We uh we're picking up a pair today. So we're gonna check them out in hand. All right. Dude, I'm saying younger uh skateboarders, what are we going for today? Palominos, my friend, Palominos, Palominos. Everyone's going for the Palominos, Palo Palo Palominos. Return of the Mac. You know how to Eric Constant the Iceman. Wait, you know how Eric Costin, the Iceman. I don't know who that is. Uh Sherlock, what's good? What did I miss? You didn't miss much, bro. You didn't miss much. You didn't miss much. You did not miss much. You did not miss much. Uh, do hoopers nowadays even know what N1 is? Oh man. N1! Palomino's jump from 190 to 210 overnight. Bro, they were they were steadily at like 200 plus, like 200, like 220, 210. I feel like once I don't know what they're gonna do in the market. Please don't ask me, okay? Because I really don't know what these shoes are gonna do in the market. I don't know. Like I don't know. Just go for them for the personal, okay, guys. If you guys are going for the Palomino, just go for them for the personal. All right. Uh, did anyone hit on Foot Locker or Champs? Uh, what's it called? Ship to me option. Did anyone hit on the ship to me option on Full Locker or Champ Sports? Feel free to let us know. Dude, did you ever play Tony Hawk Pro Skate 1 or 2? I had one of the Tony Hawk games. I don't know which one I had. I had the one that he was skating in Santa Monica. Which one is that? I had a Tony Hawk game when I was a kid on the PS, uh, the PS1 or PS... I think it was PS1 or 360. I think it was Xbox or regular Xbox. But I don't know which one it was. It was like a, a skateboarding Tony Hawk game that he was in Santa Monica. I don't know which one it is. I'm just asking these questions as a troll. Do you what you want. Enjoy the shit you buy. Facts. Facts, bro. W on flex. I hit on Foot Locker. Didn't uh, hit on either. Uh, I did on Foot Locker. Congrats. There you go. Let us know in the chat. Let us know in the chat. Let us know in the chat if you guys hit. All right. Underground, I think. I don't know what it was called, but I, that was that, that skateboard game I had. Um, yep, hit on Foot Locker, ship to me. There you go. Congratulations. If you hit on Foot Locker or Champ Sports, ship to me option, or if you guys signed up, make sure you guys are checking your apps, okay? Make sure you guys are checking your apps right now, all right? Because uh, notifications should have went out at 6 o'clock, all right? It should have went out at 6 o'clock. Foot Locker still pending. <laughs> Raffi, are you taking the family to see Taylor Swift in theaters? No. Probably not. F bot locker. Dude, I stopped using the Flex app, bro. I don't know about you guys, but I stopped using the Flex app. I absolutely stopped using the Flex app. My cyber slides are arriving today. There you go. 
Where's Brittany at? I don't know where Brittany's at. Maybe she's picking up her pair today. Brittany's probably picking up her pair today. I got my wait listed on Foot Locker, but ended up not getting off the eight wait list. Oh, no. W on Foot Locker. What's up, bro? You think these will resell, have resale value? I don't know, man. Uh, do you guys think they're going to have resale value? I think you should just buy it for the toe, bro. Go for the sneaker for the toe. Okay? That's what I recommend today. Go for the sneaker for the toe. All right? Hit both men's and gs on kith absolutely not <laughs> just go for the shoe for the toe man you should be fine all right i'm boycotting foot locker oh man he man said he's boycotting foot locker all right um why are you boycotting foot locker man they stole my money for real for real what do you mean they stole your money. What do you mean they stole your money? Just call your bank, bro. Just be like, yo, these goofy ass Foot Locker people stole my money. Just call your bank. All right. Who cares? They're super fire. Birdo says, so, so tomorrow at 1 p.m. Raw. Yes, sir. For Raw's sneaker battles. Yes, it's tomorrow. It's at 1 p.m. Eastern time, I believe. That's like 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock my time. I still try on Flex app because I have all these points, but they always let me down. Yeah. Dude, the last time, Philly, the last time that I actually tried on the Flex app was Lost and Founds. Lost and Founds was the last thing that I actually tried, and I, I'm i pretty sure I took an L. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, I did take an L. I don't mean I'm pretty sure I took an L. I took a fat L, dude. Uh, which website will you be trying on? Um, I'm not trying this morning. I'm not trying this morning because I'm already picking up a pair later. Uh, have you called your bank round? Not yet, dude. I'm, like, trying to give it a chance, but, like, maybe I should, huh, Dexter? I should call. Should I call? Resale only going to be uh, lunch money. Profit a few uh, weeks after people get pairs in hand. So cop for the personal only. Yeah. You guys cop for the personal only, bro. Um, Y'all got to start paying more attention. I said it on a million times. I mean, hey, man. Same, man. Some people, you know, feel me. Hawk. My boy, Hawk. Hawk for the twenty dollar donation. Bang that like button and share positive vibes for W's today. Can we get a W Hawk in the chat? Can we? Can we? Can we? Can we get a W Hawk in the chat real quick? A W Hawk, both on TikTok and as well as uh on stream. Can we get a W Hawk? Bang that like and share. Hawk, Hawk, for Hawk, today. Hawk, 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 Hawk. W Hawk in the chat. Man, spreading that positivity here in the chat. Make sure you guys smash that like button for the homie Hawk in the building. W Hawk for the positivity chat. Can't can't really complain about that one, man. Shout out to my boy Hawk for the twenty dollar donation. We appreciate that, Hawk. Hey, Hawk, man. You guess what, Hawk? You're gonna hit. You're gonna hit on this shoe today, Hawk. And as well, you're gonna have an amazing and blessed weekend as well, bro. For real. Okay. W Hawk, yes, sir. What up, Ben? <clears throat> Shout out my boy Ben. Seeing the building, dude. I've been so like. Like, I just need someone to punch my gut, bro. Like, just, just to get all this air out of my stomach, bro. Like, seriously. Does anyone want to do the honors and want to punch me in the gut to get all this air out, bro? Like, I really do. Like, uh, are you going for the personal? Um, I'm going to see these in hand to see how I feel about it. So, like I said, uh, I'm going to stop by a finish line today. Dude, I'm probably going to stop by my Best Buy to see if they have any Pokemon. Yeah, he says, uh, Saad says, Hawk, do a kickflip. Oh, man. He, let's see. Uh, I'm going for uh, Vermeros for the wifey today. Oh, yeah. There's Vermeros dropping on Nike, too, if you guys are interested. Vermeros are dropping this morning. You're you're 100% correct, sir. 100% correct. It's draft weekend. There you go. What do you think about the uh, hint of yellow on the Palominos? I like it. Sneaker and stripes is not a bad thing, man. Like, it's not a bad thing at all, bro. The Palominos with the yellow on it, it's not bad. I mean, you could just cover it up with your pants, bro. You're good. Uh, your girl will 100% facts, bro. Probably. Um, I can't tell if I should cop these or not. It's up to you, bro. J, uh, JB, if you want, man. Leo or draw. I think it's a Leo drop this morning, no? Is it a Leo drop this morning, chat? Is it a Leo drop? 
Is it a Leo drop this morning? I don't know if it's a Leo drop or not. Palominos are nice in hand. Yeah, Palominos are nice. I've seen them in hand plenty of times. They look really good. But I wanted, I just wanted to see them in my size. That's the only thing about it. Like, I wanted to at least try it on to give it a chance. Uh, because I was originally going to pass on this sneaker. But I was like, you know what? Let me get a chance to see them in hand. But I, I didn't I didn't manage to hit my size. But whatever. It's all good. I'll see them in hand regardless. Watching from NZ. What's NZ? Are Polyminos worth it if uh, if you have New Balance 550s? Uh, AMD and Loyor or mochas um it's up to you i mean if you already have mochas and you if you want to keep your mochas on ice then go ahead and go for these they're a leo drop a leo drop is let everyone order guys okay a leo drop means let everyone order that's what a leo drop is if anybody was wondering leo drop let everyone order 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 let everyone or new zealand okay new zealand is at as nz my bad new zealand new zealand new zealand shout out to my my uh good people from new new zealand i appreciate you guys tapping in from the from overseas guys thank you guys so much Anybody that's coming uh, from overseas, if you guys don't mind smashing that like button. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. We're on the road to 71,000 subscribers here on the YouTube platform. So thank you guys so much for tapping in every single day. It's Saturday, guys. I know you guys are going to be dry. I bet you guys, look, everyone's going to set their alarm at like 6.50, 6.55, right before the drop. People do that all the time. Mostly on a Saturday when they get to sleep in, be like, bruh, I'm going, I'm putting my ass back to sleep. Definitely double up if you can. Dang, it's a Leo. I'm surprised. What do you mean? How are you surprised? You're surprised this is a Leo drop? Uh, this, uh, that reminded me to watch Joe Coy special last night. Picking up two pairs of Udo SBs, me and the wifey, one from Skate Shop, Raffles, and uh, Berkeley. Dude, you make me want to go to my my uh, my resale shop. Maybe I, I should go see if like Sneak City has a pair of my size in the Udos. Maybe I should do some trades today. Do some trades. Get rid of some sneakers in my sneaker collection. Maybe all my regular dunks. Get rid of all my regular get dunks and go get some uh, Udos. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? What is ghost watching? Ghost watching is basically you watching the stream without being active in the chat. Do you think the red cements would be tough to cop? Um... Uh, with the red cement, I don't, I don't think it's going to be too hard from, from what the energy the chat gives me when it comes to the red cements, I feel like not, not too many people are going for them. Uh, I got so many shoes that I haven't even looked out of the boxes to put in the case yet. I should just trade a random pair for these. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Trade blog, vlog. I could do it. Trade vlog. I'm watching you Raph from Cuban or Cuba. I appreciate you, my boy. Thank you so much for the support uh college football today i'm sitting on the couch all day long there you go steve drop all your dunks for sbs yes and vlog it vlog it vlog it you guys want to see more vlogs here on the channel or what you guys want to see more vlogs here on the channel we got about 20 minutes chat 20 minutes 20 more minutes 20 more minutes guys 20 more minutes guys remember to hit that like button for some good luck all right I know most of you guys are coming here. Uh, shout out to my people, good people on TikTok. Appreciate you guys tapping in as always. If you guys are new here, drop a follow. All right. Um, does, does sneakers have ex expedited shipping? No, they don't. They used to. Um, number one ghost watcher. Who's ghost watching today? If you are a ghost watching, remember to hit that like button. Yes, it will be uh it will be dope. What up, G Face? What's good, bro? More Ravi content is never a bad thing. Wayne, thank you so much, Wayne. I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you, Ray Wayne. Trade your green off whites for the Udos or Jaritos. Thanks, Dexter. He said trade your off whites. Yeah, I need to get rid of those Brooklyn's, bro. I'm getting rid of my Brooklyn's, guys. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of my Brooklyn's. Those gotta go. Dude, uh, seriously, my girl even told me, she's like, I don't even know why you bought them. I was like, listen, woman, I didn't ask you for your opinion. <laughs> she dead ass told me, she's like, I don't know why you bought those. I was like, listen, hey, man, say, man. All right. If you are ghost watching today, make sure you guys run it up and hit that like button. I appreciate you guys. Thank you guys so much. All right. Uh, Rafi, they still do have expedited shipping. They do. I haven't really seen it lately. 
Do they ex have exclusive? I didn't see it lately. Maybe I'm tripping. Hey, please don't spam. You don't have to spam. You better get clipped, bro. Like, I don't get why some of you guys spam. Like, you're just going to get clipped. Like, if you spam on YouTube, bro, you're just going to get clipped. Like, you just waste your, your time making a, a, an account for you to just get clipped. Just embarrassing, bro. Your own fingers are probably disappointed in you. I say that to my girl. I'll be sleeping with my dogs. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Yeah, will the Palominos be an easy cop wrap? Dice? I think so, bro. I think this should be an easy cop if you actually put in the extra work on this morning. I think it should be an easy cop. So, but we got about 15 minutes, chat. 15 more minutes. Drop a share here on the TikTok live stream if you guys don't mind. Ride the chat. Yes, sir. J Million says, who's spamming? Uh, you got the, the green Brooklyn's for the content. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I did. I honestly did. Because I didn't know what to do on like day two, uh, Sneaker Con Dallas. And I was like, you know what? F it. I'm going to treat myself and buy these these off whites. And then I was like, bro, I don't even wear these. You feel me? I don't even wear these. I'm like, bruh. Yo, 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 Ollie in the building. You have to click on the shipping option right before you check out. Yeah, dude, I haven't seen that in a while. Maybe because I haven't really gone for anything much on the sneakers app. It's been a little bit. Uh, what up, Rafi? Collectibles for sale. What up, man? Ghost Ride the chat. Yes, sir. Jay Jones. Two platforms is crazy. Yes, sir, man. I mean, we got to do on both. I know I feel like live cop, like streaming on TikTok is so much different than YouTube. Uh, so it's 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 a lot different. Definitely a lot different. But we got about 15 more minutes, chat. This is when this is. Listen, guys, this is when you start to see everyone's alarm clocks go off, dude. Everyone's alarm clock is going off. They're like, this is this is people this morning. <laughs> oh, y'all. 645. I got 15 minutes. Let me snooze for five more minutes. Then they wake up at like 650. I'm up. I'm up. I'm up. I'm up. Bro, seriously, on a Saturday, some of you guys, dude, I'm not lying, dude. Everyone wakes up like last minute right before the drop. Everyone does. <laughs> you wake up chewing. <laughs> it's, just, it's just a joke. <laughs> you know, you start when you start to chew when you wake up, like mm, that means you're, you're that was a you you slept good, bro. That means you just slept good. The the my clock went off five minutes ago. Dead ass, bro. People be coming in at the last minute. You're just gonna get a whole like three, four hundred people of traffic just coming out of nowhere, bro. Because if people are just now waking up. <laughs> it's true, bro. It really is. Even on a Saturday, bro. On a Saturday, people will set their alarm like maybe like five to two minutes before the drop. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up, I'm up, all he says. Yeah, viewers just jumped up like a hundred people. Yeah, dude, it's like that, bro. I promise you. Just wait till 55 rolls around. You were probably gonna get like 900 people in here by like 55. Just because, just because everyone's alarms pop off. You're like, I gotta go. Let me see. Bro, Rafi's up. Let me let me check out these stock numbers. Boom. We got like 900. Watch. I promise we'll get 900 people here at like 655. Uh, how's TikTok going, Rap? It's going good, man. TikTok has been kind of like low key blowing up during the day. Like we don't stream in the morning too much on TikTok, but we definitely stream like uh, during the day, and it's been it's been doing pretty well. So you have to understand though, on for a Saturday, I want to sleep a bit more. In no, Francisco, I totally get it, bro, and I don't blame you. I do not blame you, bro. I don't want to listen. Like Saturdays are like not like as exciting like how they used to be back in the day. Um. Like when it comes to like sneaker drops, it's not the same anymore. Definitely not the same anymore. Alarms at 55. Just wait. We're going to get 900 people in here at 655. That's or yeah, that's my guess. Right now it's like 647, but 655, you're going to get a whole traffic people coming in out of nowhere because everyone's just waking up. I want a W today on sneaker size 13. There you go. Everyone manifest that W, guys. Manifest that W because I'm sure a lot of you guys are going to hit. I don't even think botters are going to try to touch any of these pairs, bro. Respectfully. I don't know. I don't think botters are going to try to touch any of these pairs. Supremes, uh, uh, doom next week. There we go. I only get up early because my dog keeps waking me up early in the morning. Galaxy, I feel you, bro. I feel you. I feel you, man. Uh, how's the stocks? The low stock? No, 193,000 is the stock numbers. 193K. 193K. 
All right. If you guys are new here, like I said, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys so much for liking the stream as well. Uh, we went to a, a bachelor's party last night. Definitely still feeling it. Adam, there you go. Get some rest, buddy. You know what? Go get some ramen, bro. Ramen is always good. Ramen is always good. You can't complain about ramen. You feel me? For 24K on a size 10 and a half, I should be, uh, should definitely be hitting. Yeah, just be prepared. If you guys are a size, uh, size nine and a half through a size 11, just know that you're going to be pinning for a while. Okay. For, for some reason, whenever there's a lot of stock in like certain sizes, like over 20,000 stock, you're just going to be, dude, listen, you're going to be freaking pinning for a while. So be prepared to like, pen for like over like 30 minutes okay don't be surprised if you be penning for like over 30 minutes um candy boy thank you so much for the follow david thank you so much for the follow bro thank you guys so much if you guys are on tiktok appreciate you guys tapping in if you guys want to watch the entire stream we are live on youtube at rafi collects if you guys want to check us out uh the uh the link is in the bio if you guys want to check us out uh how many for a size 13 Size 13, 11,600. 11,600 for a size 13. 11,600. Sitting in line at Snipes, but that breakfast sandwich really hits the spot. Soaks up all the alcohol. To be honest, I'm not into these Palominos. It's all good. Any updates on the uh, on your Travis Air Force Ones? Nothing yet, bro. Nothing yet on my Travises. No updates on my Travis Squats. Nothing yet, man. I'm going for them on the desktop or just release them on the app. I'm going for them on desktop. Is it just easier than the app? It's up to you. You could use desktop. You could use desktop or you could use the app. It's totally up to you. Um, uh, it, is it easy to cancel a sneakers order if I hit on two pairs? Um, I, I think so. I don't know. Juju, thank you so much for the follow. Big fine thank you so much for the follow guys hey if anybody's on the youtube platform i'm also streaming on tiktok if you guys want to give your boy a follow we're on the road to six thousand followers on tiktok so if you guys don't mind anybody that's watching the youtube platform right now if you guys could do it real quick go drop a follow on tiktok for me i really do appreciate it we're getting really close to six thousand k um a six thousand six thousand k six thousand followers on tiktok so thank you guys so much size 11 22,344 22,344 in the stock numbers for a size 11 um uh chino thanks so much for the follow size eight and a half 12,618 12,618 for a size eight and a half size nine 17,985. Uh size eight, ten thousand nine hundred and forty-seven. Size seven half, four thousand one hundred and thirty-four. So uh can you show stock numbers for a size uh seven? Of course. Three thousand four hundred and sixty-two in a size seven. Okay. Size thirteen, eleven thousand six hundred and thirteen. Uh, are these worth it? It's up to you. It's totally up to you. It's totally up to you if you really want these or not. But are they worth it? I think these are going to sell out. I personally think these are definitely going to sell out. 100%. I think so. These should sell out, guys. But make sure you guys run it up. Let's get to 350 likes. Size 9, 17,985. All right. W's for everybody in the chat. All right. Run it up real quick, guys. Can we get to 350 likes if you guys don't mind? I greatly appreciate it for TikTok. Let's run it up to 3,000 likes. All right, keep tapping that screen. Hit that follow button if you guys are new here on the TikTok streams. We're live on both platforms on YouTube and TikTok, so we're both grinding it out. Uh, we'll keep doing this mostly on Sneakers Day, too, because I know a lot of you guys are going to have a lot of questions about Sneakers Day. So if you guys don't mind, drop a follow here on the TikTok platform. And if you're not subscribed to the YouTube, make sure you guys are subscribed. All right. Um... You guys, you, my mods, can we just clip the guy? Can we just get Garrison out of here, bro? Mods, can we just, like, hide him at the chat? Let's just get him out of here. Someone just, just, just boot him. Skedaddle. Can we just boot him? Can we just, like, boot him, boot him? Just boot him, boot him. Like, boot it and boot it. Like, come on, let's boot him. Let's take him out of there. Uh, Palominos is, like, boot alternative. What do you, what? Boot alternatives. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Uh, hoping sneakers day is a lot more stocks than the Kobe restock. It probably is, bro. Yeah, just get them out of here. Just get them out of here. It's all Gucci. 
Thank you. Thank you, mods. W mods, dude. Shout out to my mods in here. Uh, I wanted you guys to do the do the favor. To the moon. Reunions coming in. I already got my unions. I already got my unions in. I already got my unions in. My unions in right here. Boom. Got my unions here. Boom. As you guys can see. Like I said, if you guys, hey, anybody that's on TikTok, hey, drop a share. Let's get all your friends. All right, get your friends in here. Make sure you guys drop a share if you guys don't mind. Let's get five shares on TikTok real quick if you guys don't mind. All right, here we go. Uh, Rafi, I'll watch uh, your show during the week at work now, waking up early, uh, waking up sleepy during the early Saturdays. Yes, sir. Alfredo, thank you so much for the 14 month re up. Big W's for everyone in the chat. Alfredo, thank you so much for the 14 month re up. Everyone, wake up, bro. Is everybody awake or what? Everyone, wake the hell up. Oh, they look good in Ann, bro. They look really, really good in Ann. Did I didn't I tell you guys by eight six fifty five we're gonna have nine hundred people in here? Didn't I tell you guys everyone's alarms are gonna go off at fifty five? Watch, everyone's everyone's alarms are gonna go off at fifty five. Look, we have almost a thousand people in here, bro. Oh, didn't I tell you guys? <laughs> Did I tell you guys? People are gonna have like, mm, 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 where's stinking burrow at? Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> oh, Rafi's like, mm, 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 mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I did I tell you guys? Where's stinking burrow at? <laughs> he's like, yo, you know, that's you say you smack when you you smack your mouth when you wake up. <laughs> uh good morning chat there we go good morning good morning good morning everybody if you guys are just now tapping in drop a follow all right hit that like button how many pairs in a size nine and a half twenty thousand twenty thousand twenty two twenty thousand twenty two Dan went from 700 people to 1k people in the steam i told you adam bro it's because people have what up sneaker jacks what's good bro i told you it's because people set their alarm like five minutes before the drop bro it happens all the time I don't know why, but it just happens that way. <laughs> um, I'm up. I'm up. I'm up. Who's just now waking up? Who's just now waking up, dude? Some of you guys are down bad. Who's just now waking up right now? Some, some of you guys are just now waking up. Some of you guys are down bad. <laughs> uh, we cook in pairs. There you go. Let's go, chat. Everyone, run it up to 400 like. I want to wish everyone the best of luck this morning run it up guys all right can we get 400 likes on the stream guys we got a thousand people in the chat TikTok, you guys do your thing appreciate you guys we are here a hundred and ninety three thousand in the stock numbers on the palomino air jordan one highs and i want to wish everyone the best of luck guys all right everyone's on morning breath <laughs> dsg's live uh-oh, DSG is live? Is DSG fishy li officially live? Dick Sporting Good. Four minutes. Where is it? Do you have the link for DSG? He said DSG, someone said DSG is live. Uh, I don't sleepwalk. I sleep cop. There you go. Uh, Rafi, if they call this the Mocha's 2.0s, will these be an instant sellout? I don't know. Not sure. I'm not sure if these are going to instant sellout. I don't know. I don't know. Four minutes, guys. Four more minutes. I want to wish everyone the best of luck. Four more minutes, guys. Four minutes. Four minutes. Four minutes. Four minutes. All right. Reservations, bro. Anybody got the um, link for that? Queue's up on finish line. Guys, link. JD Sports finish line is about to go up in the queue. I'll tag you on uh, on Twitter. Okay. Looks like uh, DSG wristbands, DSG signups are about to go live here. Are the Palomino's worth for the resale? Um, probably not. Probably not. DSG signups are today. No, the DSGA has the fours. I think it's the fours. Everyone, the DSG signups are for the fours, I believe. It's for the Air Jordan one, uh, Air Jordan fours. Here we go. Three minutes. Tag you on Twitter. Okay, let me check it out. Tag me on Twitter. Okay. 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 There it is. Locations are out for the fours.
Locations are out on the fours. Here we go. Two minutes, two minutes, Chad. Two more minutes. Good luck. DSG wristband for the sign up for the fours, guys. Here's the link. Check if your locations. That's going to go live today. If you want to stop by your DSGs today, there it is. There's the link. My bad. There it is. DSGs for the, uh, there's the link. Finish line. Q is up. JD Sports Q is up. And then I think we're set to go after this. There it is. Boom. Uh, those fours are sought out. I mean, I'm just saying, I'm just putting the information out there to someone, anybody that needs it. Okay. I'm just, I'm just saying. If anybody needs it. Hold on. Okay, okay. Okay. There it is. Boom. All right. Good luck. One minute. One minute, guys. One minute. One minute. Here's the last minute stock numbers if anybody needs it. Last minute stock numbers. That's for next week on the 9th. Yep. But the locations are now live. If you you guys could sign up for the fours today if you guys want to. So say if you're gonna go pick up the Jordan One Palominos and you want the red cements and you want to guarantee yourself a pair, then go stop by your DSG and sign up. All right. Those are the locate locations. It's pinned in the chat. All right. There you go. Run it up, chat. Hit that like button, guys. All right. Smash that like button. Let's get to 400 likes. All right, there we go. It is now live, guys. Good luck. It is now live. Finish line, JD Sports. Cues are now up as well. All right, we'll we'll still we'll be here. But let me know once you guys are in. Once you guys are pending, let me know in the chat. Once you guys are pending, let me know once in the chat when he goes. Uh, when the wait, hold on, let me see. Why is why is my link doing this? Okay, yeah. Once you guys are in there pending, let me know in the chat. Just comment pending. Just comment pending. Got him. Got him. Good luck. Good luck. The red cement fours will sell out. All you guys are tripping. We in there. We in there. Pending. Pending. Just comment pending in the chat once you guys are in. Comment pending. I hit on a size 8. Damn, already, bro? How'd you hit right away? It's not even been a minute in the release. You're saying you already hit? What the? Pending. 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 There you go. Good luck, everybody. Good flipping luck, man. I want to wish everyone the best of luck, guys. Wish everyone the best of luck. Okay, okay. Uh, Pending, 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 pending. There it is. Got a size 12 from Foot Locker. Pending, pending, pending. There he goes. Go, Alfredo! Alfredo for the two dollar donations is us f and go man. There you go Alfredo for the for the two dollar donation. Alfredo, good luck, man. Everyone is pending. Hey TikTok, if you guys are in here, let me know once you guys are pending. Hey, let's get ten new followers here on the TikTok TikTok platform. If you guys don't mind, drop a follow if you guys are new here. Greatly appreciate you guys. We're actually live streaming on YouTube. If you guys want to check us out, we got twelve hundred people in the building. So make sure you guys, if you are new here, subscribe to the channel. All right. LFG. Uh, pending. Much appreciation for the love yesterday, of course. Oh, Chef Cooks! Chef Cooks! <laughs> Look at we got a goat in the building. Everyone show love to Chef Cooks. Skinner in the building. What's good, my boy? Said thank you. Appreciate for the love yesterday. Of course, my guy. We appreciate you. The chat put me on. The chat put me on. I had to show love, bro, and show uh, show some credit. You feel me? Got to show you. Got to show the credit where uh, where we get the uh, sources from. Sometimes you feel me. Shouts to the good people from Chefs, Cook, Skinner in the building, man. We appreciate you. All right.
Um, did I say Tic Tac? Tic Tac, my bad. Did I say Tic Tac? My bad. Did I say, did I say Tic Tac? My bad. Um, I hit on DTLR. Congrats. Congratulations. Dude, water is so good. Did I tell you guys, water is so flipping good. Cop size 11, Chef Cook's link. Yes, sir. There you go. Just got a size 13. They got heavy stock. Where my, uh, where's my shout out? Shout out to my boy, Airhead HTX. Thank you so much for the link. We got to give you huge shout outs to Airhead. All right. Airhead provided those freaking, uh, that link for DSG. Um, I figured DSG was going to be today, bro. I told you my freaking DSG was hinting me about it, bro. That ass. Who got him? Who got him, bro? Who got him? Who got him? El Migos. For the five, five more for the new chair. <laughs> Yo, shout out to my boy, uh, El Migos, for the five dollar donation. This man really wants me to get a new fucking chair. <laughs> this man really wants me to get a new chair, bro. Got him. Look at all those W's, bro. Hold the front door. Let me make a poll real quick. W's, love to see it. <laughs> Did you cop? W or an L? I'm gonna make a poll for you guys so you guys could answer it while we're uh, we're waiting. Let's go. Five more for the new chair. Smiley face. There you go. There you go. Make sure you guys answer the poll. Everyone, dude, W's everywhere. Make sure you guys are posting your W's on Discord as well. All right. W in a size ten. Let's go. There you go. Congrats. Love to see it. Love to see it, guys. Run it up, man. Run it up, man. Love to freaking see all these W's, dude. Look at all that. Dude, look at all those W's, bro. Got three pairs. There we go. Anybody from TikTok, let me know if you guys hit. All right, let me know. It's all a Leo drop. A Leo drop. Let everyone order. All right. Yeah, dude, that was a quick one. Looks like probably a lot of potters. Potters are probably not trying to cook up any of these pairs. Dude, size 14 sold out. There it is. Finish sign should have been an easy W, I think. Finish line, JD Sports. I got through on both JD Sports and Finish Sign. Did anyone get through on Finish Sign or JD Sports? Dude, I got through pretty quick. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie to you. I got I got in, I got through pretty quick. Pending, everyone's still pending. Guys, like I told you guys, make sure you guys are posting your W's on Discord, okay? I appreciate you guys tapping in. I'm glad that I could help a lot of you guys in the chat when it comes to release dates. I told you guys, anybody from TikTok, DSG. Remember, I told you guys about DSG yesterday. DSG wristbands or signups for the Jordan 4 Red Cements are live right now at your local DSGs. All right. DSG, if you guys need the link, it's pinned over there on my YouTube channel. So anybody on TikTok, guys, once again, DSGs has signups for the Jordan 4 Red Cements today. So make sure you guys go sign up today if you guys need those shoes next week, Saturday on September 9th. All right. Uh, Rafi, these uh, West Coast drops times for uh, four... Uh, for a uh, 40 hour drive what w on the uh the poor man's w taking an l make sure you guys are answering the poll dude 73 percent of you guys right now are taking w's that's a lot more than l's though more than l's though right i'm joining uh like seven uh, 709 okay w in a size eight and a half junior let me give people shout outs if you guys got a w just say w i want to give some people in the shout out in the chat real quick uh let's see let's see let's see uh just put a w on a size and then uh let me show you guys w on snipe size andrew for the w uh kills collects for w adrian dela yawn it says what 12 and a half l oh no neo w tall guy still pending mario pending uh firefighter with the w vince about to go sign up on dsg jordan fours there we go uh jorge ralph tobin G Main, Chris, Iceki, Young, Brandon, Black Shinobi still pending. Um, Burr, W on a size 10. Great birthday gift. There you go. Scene Lover with a W. Adams is 1.3K stream. Run it up. Them likes. Yes, sir, man. Man, W's everywhere. Dude, I can't keep track. Uh, Dez, Jerry. Let me see. Let me give you guys some shout outs. Tony Clutch says just joined. Adam L. Brian in the building with a W. Pending on a size 11. Um, Alfredo for the $2 donation. Congratulations on all the W's, dude. There's a lot of W's in the chat. Let me give some shout outs on freaking on TikTok, dude. Uh, the 
the O Beard got a W. Todd got a W. Ish got a W. Stock is 1.5 million. Oh no. Um, Adon got a W. Roe got an easy W. Nini got a W. W on a three and a half. Wow, there's a W in the chat on TikTok, guys. That's only got a W on a three and a half. Congratulations <laughs> on the W. Jose Sparkles. got a W. B more got a W. Lily got a W. Golly, how many pairs in total? 193,000, bro. 193,000 is the stock numbers for total. Holy shimoles, bro. A lot of W's everywhere. Someone got a W in a size 14 on TikTok. Um, pending W in a size 9, Brandon says. Pending three W's. Golly, dude. Everyone getting W's everywhere back and forth. Pending on 11 and a half, 11. I told you guys with the stock numbers... Um, they were pretty high on a, like the bigger sizes. Alfredo for the two. Nike got your boy pending still. Oh no, Alfredo, what size did you go? Did you go for Alfredo? Alfredo, what size did you go for? Send this one out. It's all good if you're passing. I uh, got a size thirteen and a size nine and a half. The guy old dude says on on um on a size thirteen and nine and a half on TikTok. There you go. Uh, easy W and a size eleven. Alfredo with the dono facts, bro. Alfredo, what size did you even go for, bro? Four twelves, depending on sneakers and a size nine. Hold the line, guys. Hold the line. Like if you're a size like eight and a half through like a size eleven or eleven and a half or twelve, actually, you're gonna be pending for a while. All right, you're gonna be pending for a while. So anybody that's in here that's still pending, just hold the line. There's a lot of stock. That's the reason why. If you're pending for this long, it's because there's a whole lot of stock. All right. Um, Alien. Nike got your boy pending still. A TikTok Sparkles. here just followed you yesterday. La, LA is it la, Sorry, I'm, I'm terrible at names. I can't pronounce names. I apologize. But thank you so much for the follow here on the YouTube platform. Who cares they're bricks, bro? Who cares if they're bricks? Vincent? This dude Vincent is like, they're bricks. They're bricks. Who gives a shit, bro? All right? They're bricks. Who cares, bro? People, listen. It's good that Jordan 1s are this affordable. With them. This is a great colorway. If they're bricks, who cares, right, chat? If they're bricks, who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Uh, Drew, thank you so much for the two. What up, Raf? Shout out to my bro, Matt. Hit my 11 point. Drew for the two he says, What up, Raffy? Shout out to my bro, man. Hit on a size 11 and a half. There you go. Pending, pending. Let everyone hit. Yeah, facts, bro. Let everyone hit, bro. Let everyone hit. Let everyone hit. All right. It's all Gucci. Got him, dude. Everyone's hitting on TikTok as well. People are like saying, got him, got him, got him on TikTok. Everyone hitting. Yo, if you are new here to the TikTok, man, let's get 10 new followers here on the TikTok platform. We're getting really close to 6,000 followers here on TikTok. Let's get 10 new followers here. Make sure you guys follow it up, man. If you guys are new here to the YouTube platform as well, make sure you guys are subscribed up. All right. Guys, we are trying to grow on both flat platforms. If you guys are new here on YouTube or if you guys have been on YouTube as well, and if you guys have TikTok, make sure you guys drop a follow. All right, appreciate it. What up, Darren? Just my boy Darren Aquino in the building. What's good, Darren? Uh, everyone will eat. Everyone's eating this morning, bro. Everyone's eating. Everyone's eating. Yo, shout out to everyone that's dropping a follow here on the TikTok platform. Brian, thank you so much for the follow. Hunter, thank you so much for the follow. Leo, thank you so much for the follow. Oh my gosh, I just dropped my phone. I'm down bad. You guys, thank you guys so much. He says, the man says, I'm hitting. There you go. Congrats. Raph, if it won't let me add to card on JD and force the finish line. Oh, no. Is it is it a freaking bugged out? Is it bugged out this morning? WTF still pending. If you're pending, hold the line, bro. It's because there's a lot of stock. If you're still pending, it's because there's just so much stock. That's why. So. Put the link on here. Yeah, I got you. My bad. I got you guys. You guys want to follow me on TikTok? Here it is. I'm live right now on TikTok. We're getting really close, guys, to uh, 6,000 followers. There's my TikTok if you guys want to follow me. All right. Uh, yeah. Full Locker. Oh, finish line won't let me add to cart. Is it a glitch? Maybe it's... There's no way that it's sold out unless it is sold out. <laughs> on finish line? I wonder if it's just sold out. What do you guys think? Sold out. Sold out. All right, Christian, chillax, bro. Christian, you need to, you need to stop, bro. All right. Um, can we can we boot that guy? Can we like time him out real quick? Uh, hold the line, collection fam. Sold out on undefeated. Yeah, undefeated probably sold out, huh? 
You know why? You know why people go for undefeated? Because they probably go for the uh, sneakers at first, and then they go here. People do that all the time on on uh, undefeated. Ain't no way they sold out, bro. Ain't no way they sold out. Let's go, Raph. Yes, sir. If you guys are new to the TikTok platform, I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys drop a share on the TikTok platform, guys. We're going, we're 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 uh, going live on all platforms. So size eight, eight and a half is still left. Nine is still left. Um, nine. I told you guys. Oh, do a size thirteen is still up there too. Did you guys? Do you guys? I'm assuming. Yeah, you do. Finally hit Raph. There you go. Hold the line, guys. Hold the line. Still a lot of pairs out there. Everyone's still pending, dude. Who's still pending, dude? Anybody still pending? Anybody still pending? I wonder if just undefeated is just freaking clip, bro. Alfredo. For the two. He says Raffy is right. Hold the line. Got him. Look at that. Alfredo. <laughs> Alfredo hit. Alfredo hit King. Thank you so much for the 16 month. I'm uh, I'm for real a ghost. King Frankie, thank you so much for the 16 month re up. Appreciate you, my boy. Alfredo, dude. Look, Alfredo hit, bro. See, alien. Rafi is <laughs> Darren right. hit. Hold there we go. The Darren, line. congrats, Got bro. My boy sparkles. Darren hit. Look at that. We're getting W's. Well, I told you guys, I'm gonna hold the line for you guys if you're still pinning because there's so much stock, bro. Like, there's so much stock on this shoe. Like, if you're pending, it's because there's so much stock in like those sizes, dude. A lot of stock. Guys, promise you guys, hold the line and you're going to hit. Look how much stock there is, bro. Drew, thank you so much for the two. He says, size 13W, uh, boss. Thank you so much. There you go, Drew, for the two. Congratulations, Drew. There you go. Love to see it, dude. Drew with the W, dude. Drew with the W. Guys, look, TikTok is saying, yo, let's go. Everyone's hitting. Everybody drop a follow if you guys are new here on the TikTok platform, guys. It looks like everyone's copping on TikTok, on YouTube, bro. Look, we're helping everybody out, dude. We're helping everybody out. We're helping everybody out. Look, we're helping everybody out. Hold the line. You're going to hit. Okay? Don't. Listen. Don't give up just yet. Don't give up just yet. Yeah, DSG is they're doing uh, uh, signups right now. I have the link pinned. I hit, I hit. Alfredo, thanks so much for the two. Uh, I took um, 12 minutes, but I uh, I got them. Let's F and go. Shout out to my boy Alfredo for the $2 donations. Congratulations, my boy. There you go. Uh, Kills Collect, thank you so much for the follow, man. Thank you so much. Alfredo for another two. Dude, Alfredo is hype right now. Yo, Alfredo is freaking hype, bro. Look at that. See, then I tell you guys, just because, listen, TikTok and YouTube, listen, guys, just because a shoe is not going crazy in the resale market, the demand is there. Alien, took 12 what did minutes, I tell you guys? All right. LFG, the demand sparkles. is there for this shoe. It's just the resale. Just because the resale is not going for much, people are going to want the shoe for the toe. Jessica Abu, thank you so much for the two. Uh, JD just posted men's sold out. JD Sports finish line sold out you know why finish line in jd sports that is the first uh spot everyone goes to because people are using coupons people are using coupons that's why all right people are using coupons um but i told you guys man just because a shoe doesn't go for much in the resale market i promise you the demand is still there just similar to the unc's i've been preaching about this all week okay People were not going to sleep on this sneaker, bro. People are not going to sleep on this sneaker. It's a perfect alternative shoe. If you don't have Travis's, if you don't have, you know, Mocha's 1.0s, this is a perfect shoe to grab. It's a great shoe, great colorway. Um, but, hey, listen, the shoe doesn't go for much. So um, I'm glad that a lot of people were managing to cop pairs for the toe. Um, but, man, there's still size available. Size size 8, 8 half sold out. Size 9, 9 half, 10, 10 half, 11. Remember, remember I told you guys? Remember I told you guys? If you were a size 9 through a size 11, that was the last sizes to sell out. Why? Because look how much stock there is in a size 9. 17,000 through all these other rest of the sizes, 22,000 plus. So that's why you see these sizes still available. So um, there you go. All right. That's why it makes sense. You guys see the stock numbers? Look at what sizes are still available. Okay. 20 plus thousand pairs. And I told you guys, just hold that line. Size 13 is gone. Size 11 and a half is gone. Uh, but hold the line for the rest of the sizes, guys. All right. If you're pending for a while, that is the reason why right here.
because there's so much stock on that size. Um, your thoughts on the undefeated Converse weapon? I don't know what those are, man. I really don't know what those are. I do not know what those are. Um, shout outs to Christopher Delion for the five. Has anyone gotten their union ones? Um, your unions LA. Um, you talking about the ones? You talking about these? I got. I just got mine in yesterday, bro. I just got my unions in, in yesterday, so I just got that in today or yesterday. So unions ship through like they do like um what's it called? They're 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 shipping you know in waves. Just an FYI, they're shipping in waves. Laid a W. Let's go. Got them. There we go. Make sure you guys are tagging me on Twitter, guys. Okay, if you guys don't mind, right? Tag me on Twitter or Instagram at Rafi Collects if you guys want to. If you want to share your W's with me, make sure you guys go ahead and give your boy a follow. All right, here's the here's the link to my Twitter. Um, as well as you guys know, if you follow me on Instagram, make sure you guys drop a follow. Um, tag me even on TikTok if you guys follow me on Twitter or Instagram at Rafi Collects. Give your boy a follow. It tag me on Twitter so I can see how many W's are out there. A lot of W's, man. A lot, a lot of W's out there. Got him. J Kick says my union still hasn't shipped yet. Eleven and a half. Drew, like I said, they're shipping out in waves, so you should be good, man. I promise you'll get your shoe on time. How do you like the unions? I like them a lot, man. I like them a lot. I Has love these unions. Has anyone gotten their union fees yet? I love my unions. I love the union ones. Uh, w nine and a half. There you go. Still pending. W size ten. Thanks, Rafi, for waking me up so early, Ron. Listen, you woke yourself up, man. Unless my voice is just way too loud. If my if my voice is soothing to you in the morning, I'm glad it is, bro. I'm glad my voice is somewhat soothing in the morning for some of you guys. General links <laughs> for the ten dollar donation. He says W's for everyone. General links for the ten dollar donation. Let them know, bro. W's for everybody. Hopefully, I was able to manifest that W for you guys, all right? But there you go, guys. W's for everybody, including the people here on W's TikTok. If you guys are new to the TikTok platform, thank you guys so much for the follows, man. We're two more away to 5,900 followers. So if you guys are new here, drop a follow. Let's get five new followers here on the TikTok live stream. So if you guys are new here, make sure you guys drop a follow, guys. Raph, you ain't going for... Uh, I know I'm picking up a pair today. I will have a vlog today for you guys. So I'll have a pickup vlog for you guys today. Uh, I'm picking up a pair. So that should be kind of cool uh, to see those bad boys in hand. Still pending. There you go. Still pending. Hold the line, man. Hold the line. Oh, yeah. There's a bunch of W's, bro. 78% of you guys got a W and 22% of you guys took L's. Sold out on JD Sports and Finish Line, guys. Sold out on Finish Line and JD Sports. Just an FYI. All right. Uh, What happened, Paulo? Paulo, what happened? Got him in a size 10 and a half. Cameron says, are they sold out yet? Let me see. Let me see if they're sold out yet. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Size is 10, 9 and a half through an 11. 9 and a half, 10, 10 and a half, and 11 is still available. W on size 11. There you go. Uh, reaction says W on shoe pal size 12. Congratulations. Yantic says hold the line. Of course, man. Hold the line, guys. Hold the line, man. I just love to see all the W's, bro. The W's look beautiful in here. Mostly for a Jordan 1 Mocha. Come on now. Jordan 1 Mocha chat. Come on, dude. I ain't complaining about this. Jordan one mocha. Come on, chat. Cannot complain about that one. Let's go. Uh, woke up late, but cop the size 12. Sneaker still has pairs. No finish line sizes are backed up. They said these will sit. I told you guys, these were these, these are gonna sell out, bro. Come on, the demand is there, bro. Okay, everybody wants this pair, whether a couple people said bricks or anything like that. Who cares? People want this for the toe. Okay, everybody wants this shoe for the toe. All right. Lenard, thank you so much for the follow, bro. Lenard was my Lenard was my uh oh shoot, what am I having on my TikTok? What happened? Oh, there it goes. I was like, hello. Uh wow, I doubled up on sneakers. There you go. Beaters for the toe, baby. There you go, Yantic. Bro, I uh you what? Still painting in a size 10 G's. If you're still painting in a size 10. Nine and a half, ten and a half, and eleven. It's because there's so much stock numbers. Twenty plus thousand pairs in this in this size. No one wants a three and a half. Did GS end up selling out? GS still still there. GS is still there. I thought GS would sell out, dude. There's still so much GS sizing. No one wants GS sizing. No one wants GS. No one wants GS. 
Um, these going to be common to see the next couple months, holding mine till next year. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to leave them on ice, I'm sure a lot of people are. This is a great fall and winter shoe for sure. This shoe is definitely a great fall and winter sneaker. So I can't believe I took an L for a size nine. Got them pending, didn't get them. Yeah, Rafi is right. Too much attention to pay re uh, resale market. People think it will be an easy cop. Not always the case. Exactly, man. And that's the thing. Be people, people always rely. Oh yeah, they're bricks. They're not. No one wants them, dude. Everyone needs to stop worrying about all that shit. Seriously, that's what people start regretting and having like like start regretting it and be like oh my gosh everyone wants them everyone wants them they're selling they're selling out dude you can't you can't always just just expect like a shoe is gonna like not do well because nobody uh the resale market is low that is everyone's opinion nowadays i'm gonna put an opinion i'm on the shoe because of the resale market no like dude it doesn't have it doesn't happen like that sometimes bro okay exactly yentic who cares bro like like it's oh they're they they're did they uh they're a terrible shoe because what they don't go for nothing bro that's that's stupid bro it just shows how the sneaker game is sometimes bro okay and we've been sitting here preaching about that shit all right the demand was going to be there bro the resale market is not that crazy but the demand is there uh w in a size 10 there you go w in a size 11 half there you go got him in a size 10 on sneakers congrats all right um dubbing is sold out on sneakers but put got through in a size 10 no it's not it's not sold out it looks like sizes 10 and 10 and a half are still available oh yeah they're officially sold out guys officially chalked officially sold out guys <laughs> someone said on tiktok he said i just woke up and hit make sure you brush your teeth all right <laughs> you deserve it <laughs> Grabbing the cream laces. There you go. All right, Christian, we're gonna boot you. I'm. I don't like your language here. We're Christian. I'm sorry, bro. We, you gotta go, buddy. Okay. Sorry. Uh, feel the same way. Uh, dubbing a size nine. There you go. They ain't sitting. Yeah, these definitely ain't sitting. Chat definitely ain't sitting. Ain't ain't sitting. Ain't sitting. Yeah, they uh. They sitting in my closet. Oh gosh. Double up on a size 13. There you go. Thank you, Gen B. These will say blah 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 blah. <laughs> yo, Gen B, yo, Gen B is keeping it real. These will say blah 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 blah. Yo, if anybody's new here on the TikTok platform, hey, congratulations to anybody that hit this morning. Hopefully, you guys were able to cook out with you guys uh here at the collection family. Hey guys, we're live here on TikTok and as well as the YouTube platform. Make sure you guys drop a follow and make sure you guys go subscribe to the YouTube platform as well, man. We still got about 1100 people in the building cop and a pair of the air Jordan one palominos if you guys enjoy the stream so far make sure you guys drop a like drop a follow man i appreciate you guys for real for real uh dude guys we just hit 5900 uh, followers on tiktok guys dude i'm telling you guys Follow us on TikTok, guys. We give you guys the information for free. We provide the stock numbers this morning, 195, 93,000 pairs of the stock numbers for the Palomino Air Jordan 1. And I'm glad that I could spread a little bit of positivity this morning to the ones that really wanted a pair. And the ones that didn't hit, guys, once again, just watch for restocks, right? If you want to check out your stores locally, you're more than welcome to, right? There could be pairs, maybe people not wanting to pick up because they hit on the sneakers app and they just leave their pair in store. That could potentially happen as well. But just know it's going to be a little bit more difficult to hit in store because if, if people are not hitting online, what people are going to do is rush to their stores. So that's what they're doing. That's what they're doing. You're not doing NPCs on TikTok. No, I'm not doing that, bro. Why would I do that? FedEx stole my Air Jordan 1 unions. Oh, no, Jose. Jose, you better go get your money back, bro. Waiting on finish line confirmation. Let me know in the chat who is picking up a pair of the Air Jordan 1 Palominos this morning. Let me know in the comments down below as well here on the TikTok platform. If you guys are picking up a pair this morning, let us know. All right. Um, People is panicking. Yeah, people are panicking, bro. And it happens, man. It happens. Uh, who's the guy that hasn't hit that, uh, hit, 
in a year, size 12 pinning for 17 minutes. Happy for him because he was given up on sneakers. OG gym rat facts, bro. There's a lot of people that always try to, they, do, they always want to give up on the sneakers app and I get it, but like sometimes you win and lose some. And that's why I told people like, it sucks, bro. It sucks to be like a size 13, 12 and a half, 11 and a half. It does suck, bro. It absolutely sucks because like, it's a win and lose situation because you got all the resellers going for the bigger size. And not only that, if you do hit on a big size, it's like, oh, all right, dude, I just hit on, on my size. And if you want to sell it later, it's still going to hold its, you know, hold its value. So it's always a win and loss re uh, relationship with being a bigger size. But hey, if you hit on your personal size this morning, ha, ah, congratulations. W size 10, sneakers uh, 9, there we go. What is so good about these shoes? Um, We haven't had a brown and black shoe in a while like we haven't had this type of colorway since the mochas to 1.0 so that's the reason why like everyone likes these uh likes these palominos it's basically a mocha 2.0 so like we haven't seen a colorway like this in a while so what's the resale value on these right now they're roughly at 200 plus i think i don't know exactly what what it is right now but I get to pick up a pair today, so I'm excited to see those bad boys in hand. I hit the pickup on Foot Locker for my girl, and I hit for the personal for pickup as well as finish line. There you go. Um, got him size nine on sneakers. There you go, David. Look, David. Look, look, guys. W David, guys. Look, guys. Look, David is not clowning everybody in here. See, look, David got him in a size nine on sneakers app. If you know David, you know. Okay, look at that, guys. David actually bought a shoe that he actually really, really enjoys, and he's happy about it. There you go, David. That's the most positive comment that I've heard from you all week. <laughs> David, W in a size 8.5, W in a half, uh, 10 and a half, basically a black toe mocha is not really. Poor man's Travis Scott's. There you go, StockX, only uh, about $30 to $40 uh, dollars over retail. Yeezys are 20% off on undefeated with code LABOR. There you go, mix and pieces. We appreciate that. 20% off undefeated with code LABOR. Cause it's Labor Day weekend, guys. Um, size 13. Everyone uh, that called these bricks, please cancel these orders. Oh, man. W size 11 half men's. Congrats, man. I'm glad that anybody that's like a size 12, 11 half, or 13, congratulations, seriously, because that is always a tough one to hit. Yeah, it looks so like you say, all right, David. <laughs> Let's go, David. <laughs> You're right. We love you, David. Facts. <laughs> if you know David, you know. All right, the man has a strong opinion about a lot of sneakers, but whenever it's a shoe that he actually wants, he definitely enjoys it and uh, preaches about his his huge W. Hate being a size 13. It is tough, bros. Being a size 13 is very, very tough. Very, very tough. And I don't even know if... um. Like, like I said, I'm picking up in a size 13 today. I'm blessing somebody. So um, I'm blessing. Who am I blessing today for retail? Uh, Black, uh, Black Shinobi. I'm not sure if he's in the chat. I'm not sure if he hit, but I'm helping him cop his size and I'm picking up his pair today. So I'm hoping Black Shinobi. I don't know if he ended up hitting or took an L this morning, uh, but let us know because if if you already hit feel free to let me know if you didn't hit hey guess what your boy's blessing you for the retail price so i'm glad that it could help somebody out at least today and plus i get some content out of it so it's awesome um i've taken l's all my life on this stupid app bro i feel it bro like sir being a size 13 is very very tough and i don't blame you at all it gets very frustrating um just because there's like low stock sometimes depending on the shoe like i totally understand i get what you mean so it is definitely tough got three size 13s got them now going for a sneaker expo there you go they have fun bro w w in a size 10 and off on sneakers bro shit took 25 minutes remember i told you guys that if you are a size like uh nine through a size like 11 you were gonna be pinning for at least 30 minutes bro because there's so much stock uh three size 13 there you go uh like the cap let's go lakers thank you so much rob i appreciate that i'm at work my boss tells me to get off my phone i told her to get off my back i'm with the collection fam james just tell her dude james just go to the bathroom bro just taking just let them know that you're taking a number two bro easily 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 bro that's all you just gotta tell them i'm just taking a number two leave me alone um so you're, uh, that took my size 13. Listen, I hit in store. I didn't hit on the sneakers app, okay? I hit in store. Okay? 
I hit in store, guys. All right. By the way, I want to keep reminding you guys. Okay. 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 The Jordan 4 Red Cement DSG signups are today. So make sure you guys check out your local DSGs if you want your Red Cements. If you're picking up a pair of the Palominos, guys, if you're picking up a pair of the Palominos, stop by your DSG store. If you guys need the Red uh, red Cements, you are guaranteed a spot and a size if you guys go stop by. That's including TikTok, okay? I've been preaching about this the last couple of days about the Red Cements, that DSG signups were going to be soon, all right? So they're happening today. So make sure you guys tap into your DSG locations. If anybody needs the link on the YouTube chat for the DSG locations, it is pinned in the chat. All right. We got about 76% of you guys took a W and 25% of you guys took an L. Jeez. Red cements. Red cements. Finally got the W. There you go, Jay. If your Supreme Dunk going to be your first review video on your new full-time job on YouTube, Raph, probably I will have an unboxing video for the Supremes when I get them in. Um, DSG, yeah, Dick Sporting Good, bro. That's what it's called, Dick Sporting Good. I've always said uh, that I buy what I like. I'm not a hype beast. I resell market does not dictate what I buy. There you go, David. Preach it, David. David, preach it, my brother. Preach it. Preach it. There you go, David. We appreciate you, David. All right? David, even though your uh, opinions are, you know, to yourself sometimes, we appreciate you, man, for real, for real. Uh, literally walk into DSG right now. There we go. Red Cement 4s are growing on me. They have they have good leather, guys. The Jordan 4s, I see them in hand. The Red Cements, they have better quality than the Red... Uh, excuse me, than the... Um, uh, I would say has better quality than the Fire Red 4s. Okay? I have the Fire Red 4s. I guess if you want to compare the Red to that, um, the quality on the Red Cements is a lot better than that shoe. Just, just saying. Uh, I picked up at Snipes and store. There you go. I'm not buying, but what do you think about resale is? I don't know. Resale is not, I don't know what resale is looking like. Just wait until people get pairs in. I'm not sure right now. They're roughly at around 200 bucks right now. So they're not going for like, they're going for like $20 over retail. So they're not going for a crazy amount. Like that's, what's beautiful about the Jordan one silhouette right now is that if you don't hit, listen, if you don't hit bro, like, dude, look at this. There's not much resale. So like, it's like $20 over. Seriously, $20 over retail. So it's like you could buy a pair locally for basically retail, I think. Peace, Rod. Thanks for helping get the W. It's always love here with you and the collection family. Of course, Adam, man. Thank you so much for your constant support. Um, thank you guys so much. Seriously. Even the people on TikTok, if you guys are taking out your time out of your day um, and hanging out with us and I, I can manage to help you guys cop a pair of sneakers for retail, man, hey, this, I'm, fi I'm fine with it, man. So thank you guys so much. It's the This is like the first stream that we uh that we started that uh i'm going full-time on youtube so thank you guys um you're gonna see me a lot more on tiktok and obviously on this youtube platform um and, and I'm, I'm having fun with it guys and that's what's what we should do just have fun of cop and shoes together uh you got the w um i did get a w i get to pick up my fair define i see you I, I get to pick up a pair today so we're gonna check those out in hand so Palomino's uh 250 for my size 13. Oh man, is it 250 for a size 13? See, that's why it's always tough for a size 13. No, it's like 220, bro. 220 for your size, 230. So I guess it's not that's not terrible, right? Um have you got your unions yet? Yeah, I just got my unions in yesterday. I got my unions in yesterday. So as you guys can see, I got my unions in yesterday. Uh, didn't get them. Uh, GS restocked. Which do you prefer? Orange lobsters or Supreme SBs? Probably orange lobsters. Orange lobsters is probably what I prefer the most. Orange lobsters. So, um, I bought mine in a size nine. The moment they dropped, it said pending. So I closed the website, but now it's sending sold out. How will I know if I hit or not? I mean, you could check your bank account to see if you got charged. You could check your bank account to see if you got charged. You could absolutely do that too. Um, if you don't see anything, did they say what they are releasing on sneakers day? No guys. Once again, I will have detailing for sneakers day next week. Um, I, I would predict this is that like, it's either that Jordan brand or Nike. Excuse me. I feel like Nike either will load them up early, right? Or you'll find out a couple days before the drop because, you know, people could see what happens, you know, what's loaded in the back end. So I feel like that's what will happen before sneakers day. 
right? Sneakers Day. We got Sneakers Day and Red Cements next week. Uh, exclusive access on Fan Shine and JD Sports will go live on the Jordan 4s on Wednesday and Thursday of next week. So that's a little bit of our, some early info. Even on TikToks, right? Red Cement, Jordan 4s, exclusive access on Finish Line and JD Sports will go live on Wednesday and Thursday. In-store Wednesday, um, pre-order on Thursday. And then obviously, if you want to join Flex app, you're more than welcome to as well. And then we have Sneakers Day on September 9th. So we got all that stuff going on next week. So we'll show you if you got them or not. Uh, what do you mean? It's funny how most of my grails were bricks at one point. Yeah, it's all good. It's all Gucci. Rafi, what's your opinion on Supreme SB on the toe? I want to wear, but I'm not sure if I should. Um, it's all it's up to you. I get my pair next. I don't know when I'm supposed to get my pair. I gotta look at the tracking, but I should be getting my pair in probably sometime next week. They got shipped out yesterday, so got a W must be a brick. Oh man, I'm Gucci. Did you get from the Union website? Yeah, I got this from the Union website. I live in Seattle, so I'm I'm assuming that's why my my pair got here pretty quick. So it only took like two days to get to get to me so when the union came in you had to sign for it no yes you have to sign for the unions they it's a, a sign required mine they signed it for me so i guess it just depends on your delivery driver but most likely you're gonna have to sign for it so you have to sign for it <clears throat> uh once again uh keep an eye on resale prices on go okay did anyone take an l um there's some people in here that took an l some people in here took an L uh, just because depending on the size, I would say people that hit like are a size 14, 13, 12 and a half or 12. Um, it definitely a difficult, difficult size to hit. So what up, homie? Welcome to the fam Terp. Yes, sir. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys drop a subscribe uh, and make sure you guys go ahead and follow if you guys are new here on the TikTok live stream. Easy pickup on sneakers. EU still had them in full size. Yes. Yeah, someone said the EU was sitting, bro. I feel like EU doesn't show like much love for Jordan. Like feel like, like Jordan in general is not as popular. Jordan is not as popular out there in the EU versus how here in the US. So is DSG in store signups? Yes. So if you guys want to know where the locations are for DSG for the red cements, it's pinned in the chat if you guys need it. All right. It's pinned in the chat if you guys need it. Um, yo, everyone say hi to Terp. What up, Terp? What's good, bro? I hit twice Hibbets and Foot Locker. Congrats, man. Um, Rafi, I copped the Palominos. Should I try those and return the UNC toes? Wait, why would you want to do that? Why'd you, why would you want to do that? Are the red cement, are the red cements going to sit? No, red cements will sell out. It's a Jordan four. All Jordan four sell out. Um, does anyone know about, about unions do their shipping? They, they, uh, for shipping for unions, if you're still waiting for the ship, your shipping for union, they do it in waves, okay? They do it in waves. They ship out in waves. They don't ship out everything all at the same time because they're shipping out from LA. So I personally don't like the red cements. Yeah, some people it's a love and it's a love and hate shoe. Um, but the quality on the Jordan 4 Red Cement is actually pretty decent. I haven't gotten tracking for my unions. Yeah, keep an eye on it. I think they're gonna start like they ship out in waves once again. I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of you guys get a notification this weekend that your sh your shoe gets shipped. So I uh, got the double up pin on the sneakers and picking it up locally at finish line. There you go, Roy. Congratulations. How's the leather on the red cements for compared to the SB fours, bro? Um, I don't know exactly. I would say the Jordan four quality on the SB is a little bit probably better than the regular Jordan four red cements, but the quality is not bad at all on the red cements at all. Okay. It's not bad at all. All right. Uh, crazy. I guess LA will get uh, them last because I haven't gotten anything. I'm good on the red cements. I have the fire reds. Have too many red and uh, white shoes. Yeah, like that's why I'm saying like if you don't have any, if you need like a fresh red, black, and white sneaker, like Jordan 4 red cement is a perfect shoe to grab. It really is. It's a perfect shoe to grab for, uh, you know, for a fresh red and black and white shoe. Um, Sup, family? Jones, what's good, man? What's good? What's good? Appreciate you tapping in, man. Uh, shoe pals for the win. There you go, Nicholas. Congrats. There we go. Let me check sneaker W's. All right. We got we got Discord right here. If you guys are a member, if you guys are not a member yet, make sure you guys are connecting your YouTube account to Discord. Sneaker W's. Let's check it out, guys. Sneaker W's, sneaker W's, sneaker W's. Got him. Dude, look at all these W's starting right here. Boom. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Holy shamoles. A lot of W's. A lot of W's. There it is. 
A lot of W. Post your W's here. Sneakers Day is the same day the Red Cements come out. It is. It is. It is weird, bro. It is weird that what's it called that they're they drop they're dropping the uh, red cements on the same day as Sneakers Day, which kind of makes no sense. Uh, the J Balvin threes supposed to be coming out this month on the twenty third. J Balvin's were supposed to drop today, but unfortunately they didn't. But J Balvin's are going to be on the twenty third of this month. They should load up soon, I think. But they most likely will drop on the J Balvin website. That is a shoe that a lot of you guys are excited about. The J Balvin Jordan threes. You guys are absolutely excited for that. Palomino's went up a little bit. Yeah, it's because everyone's panic buying. That's why panic buy is like a real thing. Panic buying is a real thing. It really is. Uh, Ravi, what when what does waves mean when you said they're shipping in waves? So basically, like I would say, like Union ships out like a certain amount of sh uh, shipping shoe, like shoes, all all at once, right? So like. They probably pack up as many as they can in a certain limit, and then they send them out on a Monday. And then that entire week, they're packaging more shoes that week and then shipping out the next wave of uh, of shipment on, on the next following Monday. You know what I mean? So, like, they ha all the stock is coming from L.A., so, like, you got to imagine how many shoes they got to ship out, like thousands of thousands of pairs. So that's that's the reason why like i say they ship out in waves like that's what i've noticed because last week there was a bunch of people i got shipment on the unions and then last week i got my my uh wave of uh i was in the second like the second third wave and i got my my confirmation that i got freaking tracking so it, i think it just based off you know based off uh of uh how many pairs that they ship out so your pair will eventually get shipped out. Appreciate you, Raph. Congratulations on the full-time job, you too. Thank you, man. I appreciate the positive comment, man. Thank you so much. It does mean a lot to me. You guys definitely keep me motivated for sure. Like, I really do appreciate you guys tapping in onto the live streams. And I'm hoping that my live streams benefit to your, uh, of you buying shoes. Um, I'm going to provide as much information as possible, every single stream as much as possible uh, to give you guys as much detailing to where to buy these sneakers at. Whether if it's on sneakers app, finish line, JD Sports, um, undefeated. I know I kind of dropped the ball on undefeated. I wish I kind of was on top of it, but there was so much going on in the last minute of the drop. I kind of missed out and dropped the ball on undefeated. I should have pushed that out a little bit faster. Can you believe my Amo Manier fours haven't shipped out yet? Oh no, that's cap. There ain't no way. Just got Palominos. Had to go half size up though. Okay, there you go. Congrats. Glad that you guys caught a W for real, for real. My Supreme Dunks haven't shipped out yet. Jose, your 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 Supreme should be shipping out soon, man. I promise. You will get a shipping information very, very soon for the air or excuse me, for the Nike Dunk Low Supremes. All right. Got both uh got union shipping notifications yesterday. There you go. Appreciate all you do, bro. I don't know, Nikita. I appreciate you supporting the channel. Your streams are entertaining as well. Um, as informative. Appreciate you and your time, man. Of course, kills kicks. Thank you so much for your constant support in here, man. Thank you. It does mean a lot to me. Uh, never close the app while pinning automatic L. Um you have to go, Raph Jose. Thank you so much, bro. Finally, a dub on sneakers app. Yantic, did you uh what size did you hit, Yantic? Did you hit on uh did you hit on your personal? Should I should I just um, skip on go or wait a while? Um, just wait. I mean, if you guys are wondering if you wanted to pay resale or not, just wait like a week or two. Just wait until people get pairs in. See what the market does with the Jordan One Palominos. Just see what it does. Just got my Supremes yesterday. Shipping yesterday. There you go. Udo's coming in today. There we go, man. Great week of sneaker drops, man. Great week. They shipping out all week. Parham says. Yes, sir, man. I'm excited. I'm excited to get my Supremes in. Do you think there's a chance any Travis Scott's drop on Sneakers Day? No. I don't think so. Yep, size 10 for the toe. There you go, Yantic. I got my size, but they canceled it. Not sure why. You had on your size where? On Sneakers app? They canceled your what? Your Palominos? Ain't no way they canceled your Palominos already. Ain't no way. If you can't, if you're saying that they uh, canceled your Palominos, bro, man, I don't know about that. 
Next shoe on my radar are the Air Max 1 OG Obsidians. Yeah, speaking of Snake John, yo, everybody, what is your guys' expected shoe that you guys are copping next? I mean, we got the Palominos, obviously the Red Cement's coming up. We got J Balvin's coming up soon. What up, Primetime Kicks? What is a shoe that you guys are looking forward to here to drop very, very soon? Which colorway is better, Union Toes or the Palominos? I'm going to go UNC's. I love the UNC's. I like what they do every single year for that shoe. They've never really disappointed with the UNC colorway. So um, I'm going to go with the UNC's over the Palomitos. Um, Kashi, thank you so much for the two. Just wanted to show love. Kashi, man. Thank you, bro. Thank you, man. That I really do appreciate that, Kashi, bro. Thank you so much for the $2 dono, bro. And um, appreciate the love, man. Celebrate the first super chat from Kashi. Shout out to you, my boy. Thank you. Playoff 8s, that's a good one. Born and Raised. There's another SB dropping in a few weeks. Okay, easy on take. I haven't seen them. What? I don't know what SB is supposed to drop here soon. Um, Got to go on the adventure through the Rocky Mountains, uh, though. So got to run. Thanks again, Raph. Kills Collect, stay safe, bro. Have a great weekend and happy Labor Day weekend to you, my friend. Appreciate you. Um... Satin brands are next. I'll wait for the DMPs. Those 11s are fire, bro. Those 11s are really, really nice. I like those 11s. I'm looking forward to the black and uh, green Jordan 1 high goals. There we go. Anybody else got a payment failed error this morning? Oh, no, Johnny. Johnny, you got a paid uh, failed error? Royals, I don't know what they're releasing, though. Royals should be in November, I think. Are you talking about the reimagined Royal 1s? Should be... They're not calling it the DMP 11s, guys. Do you guys, did you guys see that from Just Z wanted to show love crossed fingers they're not calling they're not calling it the um what's it called they're not calling it the uh the air jo jordan 11 dmp they're actually calling it the air jordan 11 um gratitudes seekers play too much deleted the app oh man anyone need Balaminos playoff eight shock drop oh, i don't know about that we'll see i feel like if sneakers day ever if sneaker day has a a, a a shock drop. I wouldn't be surprised if they do have a shock drop on the playoff eights. But I think obviously the red cements are part of the sneakers day. So yeah, that's that. So that is that. Uh, I got payment fail error SMH. It's called gratitude 11s. Yep. Gratitude. Gratitude 11s. Uh, they're a great shoe. Black Nimbus though, right? This is like one of the best newest colorways to drop in a while right i feel like the best new colorway in a jordan 11 like besides the ogs is probably the air jordan 11 72 and 10s 72 and 10s were probably the best but maybe the gammas maybe the gammas gammas could be up there but i'm saying i'm gonna go with the number one best new colorway in the last 10 years that they've dropped jordan 11s it's got to be 72 and 10s you could put the the gammas up there, and then if you want to put the uh, this, I think gratitudes is going to be there up there as well. These gratitudes are actually really really nice. If you missed out on the concords, perfect alternative too. It's a great shoe. It looks really really good. The quality looks great. Um, the colorway is great. Uh, I got no complaints. The box presentation is pretty good as well, right? Uh, but other than that, like I think I think it's a great shoe. So. Uh, gratitude is a better name than DMPs. Don't disrespect. Exactly. So that's cool. You're right, Vince. Right? I feel like if they did put a DMP name on there, I feel like it'd be low key. Like, damn, this is nothing. Look, this has nothing to do with like the DMP colorway. Not even close. But gratitude. I'm glad that they changed the name for sure. I like. Uh, it's like they hear the talk about uh, they're not really DMPs and decided to rename them. Yeah. I mean, I think it's. I mean, who knows? Like, DMP was never a plan to begin with. Maybe there was never a plan to begin with to, to name it DMP. So, cap and gallons deserve to be up there. Cap and gallons were pretty nice. I feel like cap and gallons were close to the gammas, but, like, for the cap and gallons, they had, like, what? A suede nubuck upper with the... Uh, with the uh the all black with the uh the gamma gumbada or the gamma soul which is not bad at all i think that was a nice little touch jordan 5 georgetown it took me 25 to get a w on sneakers uh took you talking about 25 minutes took you 25 minutes for a w it's all gucci bro it's all gucci uh but it's saturday guys all right it's saturday everybody ladies and gentlemen Ladies and gentlemen, all right, boys and girls, I want to thank you guys. I'm going to let you guys go on this fine Saturday, okay? It is Saturday. I don't want to hold you guys up too long. 
Uh, we'll be live probably on Monday, most likely. Monday, Sunday for TikTokers. I will be live on Sunday, most likely. We'll talk about Sneakers Day, kind of make it low-key. All right, just kind of push out the algorithm a little bit. But guys, I want to thank you guys all week long. This month, starting the month hot with the Palominos is amazing. Uh, once again, if you guys are going to go pick up your Palominos Jordan 1s, please stay safe out there. Um, by the way, if you want to check out if your location got the red cements for DSG, the link is pinned in the chat. Make sure you guys want to sign up for that. You'll guarantee yourself a pair and a size if you want to stop by. Make sure you guys go treat yourself, treat the wifey, treat your husband, treat your kids, right? It's Labor Day weekend, all right? Kick your your feet, you know, kick your feet up and, uh, you know, enjoy your weekend, guys. Three-day weekend, whatever the case is. Um, uh, you guys stay safe out there. Thank you guys so much for tapping into the stream all week. Uh, we'll be live next week. So we got Sneakers Day. We got Red Cements dropping. Spin, thank you so much for the 17-month re-up. Yo, Rafi, happy Saturday to everyone. Facts, Spin. Happy Saturday, Facts. I just want to leave you guys with a good note. So uh, you guys enjoy your weekend. Stay safe. Um, follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter. Uh, follow me on TikTok as well if you guys have not. Uh, appreciate you guys hanging out with me. I know Saturday, you know, I don't like to take too much time out of your uh, Saturday. So, but leave a like. Let's run it up to 550 likes if you guys don't mind. Okay. 550 likes. Run it up real quick. You guys stay safe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. All right. Congratulations to all the W's. Remember to post your W's on Discord as well. All right. But love you guys. I'm out of here. I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Peace.